Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome to another live stream. Uh, big day today, Elden Ring is coming out today. It's actually out, it's supposed to be out in like 15 minutes, so I thought it'd be fun to go live a little bit early, just do like a just chatting kind of a stream. Uh, you guys get a chance to see my ugly mug. Uh, I've actually <laughs> had to borrow my, my daughter's webcam, because she has one and I don't, just to show how technologically advanced I am. Uh, but welcome anybody who's here in the chat so far, or if you're watching on the channel afterwards, welcome as well. As always, a big thanks to everyone who's clicked on the join button to become a channel member. I really appreciate the support. Uh, all of you have been fantastic. But a special thanks to all of our top tier Mistakes Are Made members that were highlighted right at the start of the stream. Uh, for some of you, this might be the first time you've seen my ugly mug. This is it. Disappointment over. <laughs> Uh, but welcome everyone. Uh, I'm really, really excited to play some Elden Ring tonight. Uh, it goes live at like 6 p.m. Eastern time, which is something like 12 minutes from now. <laughs> I look tired. Well, thanks. That's my resting tired face. Uh, yeah, that's what that's what I have. I'm, I'm always, I'm always, am, have I gained weight? Yes. Yes, I have. Uh, I've been sitting on my backside working at home for like two years, uh, just doing nothing but uh, working at home and then doing YouTube at night, uh, that's not conducive to uh, good exercise and stuff. So yeah, no, I've uh, definitely put on a little bit of weight over the uh, the last little bit, uh, being home from COVID and everything, but, and I have definitely gotten gray. Uh, now things are a little bit different here. Uh, this is a little more gray looking than I normally am. Uh, I don't have a good lighting setup because I don't normally use a webcam. So I had to improvise a little bit. Uh, the white settings are maybe a little bit off. So I definitely look a lot more pale right now than I normally would. My face looks really pale. My hair is really pale. But uh, yeah, I'm a I'm a little bit gray. I like to my my daughters like to dye their hair. They're all into like the pink and the purple and all that stuff. I just say I dye my hair gray. This isn't the real color. This is my fake color. <laughs> Where's the brown hair at? Oh, it's under here somewhere. It's under here somewhere. It's got brown under there somewhere. I know. Thanks, Rabin. Appreciate it. Silver Fox, that's me, yeah. The normal look for someone that's been born on Pangea. Oh, gotcha, Shas. You know, everybody with their wonderful supportive comments, and my dog is going nuts. By the way, referencing someone's weight is extremely disrespectful. <laughs> Welcome to my chat, honey. This is uh this is the chat that's not super respectful. Uh this is the chat that rags on me constantly because they um show their love through hate. <laughs> dye my hair purple. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna do that. I've never dyed this hair. It's never getting dyed. Unless, for some reason, I get, like, ambushed by my kids or something, and they, uh... They unfortunately get a hold of my hair and do something to it. But that's not happening, so don't get any ideas. Not really into the whole dyed hair thing. Yeah, so we got, uh, we got about ten minutes to kill. Hopefully it'll be live like right away at six o'clock. I don't know if there's going to be a day one update. There usually is for games that you can preload. Uh, they give you a chance to load in the game ahead of time or download it early, but then they usually push an update on day one and then we'll have to deal with it from there, but we'll have to see. They can deal with me, you're my hot love slave. Oh, well, thanks, honey. Right. <laughs> Five years older than you, Fox, so I guess I predate rocks. I guess so. I'm, uh, I've been trying to compete with dirt. Um, but I, I'm just not quite old enough for dirt yet. We're, we're pushing hard to get there, but one day, one day soon. <laughs> yeah, uh, I mean, I'm not that old, but when it comes to video games, I'm, uh, ancient. Ancient. Oh my god, there's a bear. I'm, uh, there might have been. Might have been. Do you, have a, do you have a day job other than YouTube? Yeah, this is not my full-time job. Uh, this is just something I do at night. I uh, do it for a little bit of fun, a little bit of extra income. Uh, my wife and kids tend to go to bed a lot earlier than I do, so this kind of gave me something I can do that uh, lets me tap into something. Um, I, don't, I, I was already playing video games, so it was like a perfect opportunity to, to turn that into something else. Uh, my day job, I have a regular 9 to 5, uh, working for a company, doing a lot of office work, a lot of spreadsheets. A lot of uh, business optimization type stuff. Do you think your character may have multiple deaths today? Nope. Nope, this is gonna be a flawless run. No deaths at all, zero deaths, just like when we were playing Dark Souls 3. <laughs> I, I have a death counter ready, don't worry, because I'm sure we're gonna get splatted a lot. Um, I did see someone, uh, I was watching Tag play a little bit early this morning uh, because he figured out how to get access to it early by changing his country code. Um, I saw him get uh, playing around a little bit, so I've seen a little bit of what the game looks like. Obviously, I've watched all the trailers and stuff. Uh, I have kind of avoided 
all the the the, the server test stuff because I didn't want to know too much about the game before going in. Um, in terms of like. I learned a little bit about the lore and that kind of stuff, but I didn't want to see too many uh, too many boss fights or anything like that that might give things away. So uh, we're going in relatively blind. I have a sense of what the game's about because, of course, I've played Dark Souls and I've been following the development of the game. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be interesting. We're gonna go splat a lot, I think. Don't you worry. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll get that counter up there nice and high. I've already got it ready here on my stream deck, so we can uh, we can increment away. I'm waking up with pink hair is quite plausible. No. Am I 1980s old? No, no. I'm not 1980s old. I'm 1970s old. <laughs> I was born in 76. Love the posters. Yeah, this uh, this these are great. Um, I got them for Christmas, actually, a few years ago. So, obviously, I have oxygen unincluded here. Uh, I have Don't Starve here. And then, you can't see it because it's off camera, but I have another Don't Starve poster over here. The one that has all the mobs on it. So, you've got, like, your beefalo and your barger and all that kind of stuff on it so it's just like completely covered in those types of things and then i have another one um i haven't found a place to put this up yet uh, but this is the one for uh crossroads elegy from the long dark uh, and it's signed by all the people that made the game um i haven't got a place to put it yet i could put it like maybe probably put it on the wall in front of my desk I just don't want to hit it because my desk goes up and down i've got one of those uh one of those sit stand desks that are that are motorized so I can stand up when I want to, but born in 67 and play every day. See, BME will keep you young. My it's my argument. I'm convinced at some point in the future I'll be like 90 years old if I live that long, and my wife will still be teasing me and calling me a geek for playing video games. <laughs> uh can we talk about if you're gonna play more Dark Souls 3? Like it's very awesome. Uh I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna be focusing on Elden Ring. Um, assuming we, we end up beating Elden Ring and I'm done doing stuff with that, that I might go back to Dark Souls 3. But when I played it the other day, I did say that I was going to stop playing it in favor of playing this. Uh, and I was pushing to get um, Dying Light 2 finished so that we would have that done already before we started an Elden Ring. Uh, because I know it's going to consume a whole bunch of time. I'm going to play it tonight, probably until around midnight Eastern time. So we'll have... You know, somewhere around six hours of playtime in the game tonight, depending on exactly when it unlocks. Uh, and then tomorrow, I actually took the day off work so I can stream during the day tomorrow. And then, pray the Lord, the kids don't have uh, a snow day tomorrow and drive us insane. But um, they might end up being home also, so we'll see, I guess. This is a, this is effectively Dark Souls 4. It's, it's not the same game. It's, you know, they've made some changes to some of the mechanics in the game. You know, there aren't bonfires anymore. Now there are Sights of Grace. Uh, it's open world. There's a mount you can ride around on. There's a jump button, which is something we haven't had before. Instead, you had to like combine running with like clicking something else to do a jump. Um, yeah, so there's there's a few things that are different, um, but it's in the same spirit as Dark Souls, and it's I don't even know if it's supposed to be like the same universe concept, but same same core of the game. It's like the they kept the golden nugget in the middle, the way that the combat works and uh, the way that the story's revealed through interesting little tidbits of information and in all the items you find in the spells and descriptions and items you pick up and people you talk to uh, so very very cool what character am i going to play that's a good question there are like uh i want to say 10 different character classes, 12 different character classes in the game i can't remember which it is it might be 12. Uh, i'm leaning towards uh, either a confessor or a prisoner because both of them combine using uh melee combat with magic uh, and that's kind of what I want to lean towards, I think, this time around. I'm leaning towards probably playing the Confessor, because they start with some armor and a shield. <laughs> and when we were playing Dark Souls 3 the other day, we, we went in as the Wretched. Uh, or, is it the Wretched? I don't know. They're called the Wretched in this, I think. Anyway, we went with, like, nothing. I had, like, a club. Level 1. I got my butt handed to me just a little bit. I mean, we kind of got through it, but... It was, uh, I'm, I don't know, I'm leaning towards maybe starting with some equipment this time. Uh, at least for the first playthrough, I want to go back and play a Wretched ultimately, but for the first playthrough, I think I'm going to pick something that actually has something to start with. Magical playthrough perhaps today? Well, again, I'm going to try to use like some magic, some melee. Uh, I'm going to use a mix of the two of them, and then this is the kind of game I could see maybe playing multiple times, so you can try out the different classes um, and try out the different... Uh, different abilities and stuff. For the most part, the classes just define the way you start. Because later on, you can you can pick anything you want to as you're going through and expanding on your stuff. Um, so, 
you know, depending on how you level up, will depend on how you're going to spend your points and what you're going to ultimately play as, but... Elder Ring, let's go! So many mistakes will be made. Oh yeah, Bob Ross. Happy little mistakes. Millions of them. <laughs> I wonder how big this counter can go to. <laughs> I, I, I don't I don't know. I think it has an unlimited number of numbers it can put in, so... We might test that and see how far we get, I guess. We'll see. Holy fox! Wait, are you telling me to go holy, or are you saying holy because you can see this mug, this mug here on the screen? I'm not sure which. <laughs> Can't wait till midnight when I can play. Yeah, if you're if you have it on console, you can launch, you can play it early. I think on um, on Xbox you can set your country code to like New Zealand or something, and then it's available to play. It was hours ago. Uh, and then PlayStation, I think if you wanted to play it early, you had to actually buy the game in the market that you uh, you wanted to set your country code to for that to work. But then otherwise for PC, it's uh, it's available soon, like uh, like just a couple minutes soon if it actually goes live right on time. Kind of sitting here staring at the uh, staring at the, uh, the the Steam screen, waiting to see when it's going to give me the pop up saying we can actually play the darn game. I think Confessor's Faith and Astrologer and Prisoner's Sorcery. Yeah, well, so the um, the Confessor is is a faith build. Yeah, so a combination of melee and faith, and then the uh, the Prisoner is um, is the melee and sorcery, and the sorcery in this game is based on uh, based on the stars. So. It should be interesting. I don't know. It, it, I don't know. I've got to check it out. I, I don't know a ton about all the different classes and stuff. And so I haven't seen any in-depth information about the magic systems. We'll have to figure all that out. It's the great part about starting a brand new brand new game is, you know, there's there's obviously people that have already been theory crafting the game. People that got access to the early play tests and stuff uh, had a chance to play around and try out some of the different things. And so they've got a bit of an advantage, but... Uh, it's that chance to kind of get in when it's still fresh and people don't necessarily know a ton and kind of figure things out as you go. The hard part about playing a game that's been around like Dark Souls 3 for like half a dozen years is that everybody knows all the ins and outs of the game. Um, so it's kind of kind of fun to find things that you, you just didn't know about before. Nice to put a face to a voice. I started watching Dying Light 2 and 7 Days to Die. Thanks for the content. Well, thanks, Todd. Glad you enjoy it. Yeah, this is my... Uh... This is my face. It doesn't come on camera very often. It's a very rare occurrence for me. Uh, I'm kind of leaning towards uh, making some changes to the channel um, so that I'm, I'm thinking of getting some uh, like a cam and some lighting so that like at the start of a stream we can have this kind of a setup or we can just say hi and stuff while I'm booting up the game. Uh, and then when I'm actually doing the gameplay, turning the camera off so that you can enjoy the full screen version of the gameplay. Unless there's something worth reacting to like a horror game or something where you know, me jumping in my chair might add to the entertainment value. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm not. I'm not sure like how often we'll use it. But my God, it's six o'clock, but it's still not ready. Chat cam sounds good. Yeah, I was thinking something like where, like at the start of the stream, I'll use this um, kind of a setup where we can chat and stuff, and then uh, at the end of the stream, maybe when I'm like uh, signing off or whatever, we can chat briefly and then just you know follow up from there. I have, uh, I have stream beats playing, and it's uh, I swear to God, I'm hearing an advertisement. It is an advertisement. What? <laughs> All right. Didn't know that was gonna happen. <laughs> I had no idea that stream beats had ads like peppered into it, but I guess it's on Spotify, so I guess. I guess they got to get their their buck in there too, right? <laughs> I was like, I need some sort of background sound other than my voice <laughs> when I'm uh, when I'm starting the stream, and so I just fired this up. But Phil says coming February twenty fourth. Come on, game! Don't be like this. Not like this. Try exiting and relaunching. Uh, what cam did you get? This is better than the phone. Yeah, this is my daughter's cam. It's a Logitech C nine twenty. Um, so it's not, uh, it's not what I normally, uh, obviously, would use. I've just been using my phone, uh, which is really not ideal. I don't, I don't recommend it. It works, but it's not, it's not super ideal. Mm -hmm. Looks like an average dude in his 30s. A little chubby, though. Well, thanks, old school. The camera does add a few pounds, but I've definitely added some pounds myself in, uh, you know, COVID times. 
Yeah, we don't need... I don't need to find bears. There are bears in this game. They're huge. And they do not look friendly. <laughs> we don't want to mess with those if we can avoid it. Uh, let's see. I just relaunched. Oh, oh downloading. <laughs> All right. So uh, stream day or not stream day, but uh, launch day. Launch day update. Download. Download queued. Updating. Ooh, baby. We're almost there. We're almost there. I feel like I've been waiting for this game forever. I, I really enjoy the Dark Souls games. I've never been like the master of them or the person who knows like little like literally every little bit of lore about the game or anything, but they're just so fun to play and it's still not available. Uh, come on, it just updated. Property. Try uh, verifying my game files or something and see if that helps. Files. Hate waiting for a launch. My only question, can you build a base? Uh, nope, not so much. Yeah, this is a blue Yeti mic. I'd like to swap it out at some point to something else. I just haven't, I haven't bothered to make the investment. This is the same, the same mic I've been using since I started. Uh, and the quality of it's pretty good. And so I haven't, I haven't seen the need to change it out. Um, most of the options that are available otherwise are pretty expensive. Um, and so kind of been leaning towards using the same, the same microphone rather than changing it. Also cannot launch. No, it's still waiting. It just says this item's not yet available. It's supposed to be live already, but we'll see what happens. Did I pre-order a Steam Deck? No. No. I think I I, uh, I spend too much time with video games as it is already, probably. To never mind have to like walk around with a device like that. I'm pretty sure my wife would either murder me or divorce me. <laughs> it's bad enough sitting at the computer playing the game. Never mind carrying it around the house. Uh, this is not my camera. This is my daughter's camera. She has a Logitech C920 that we got her for Christmas, so I borrowed that just for this stream. Uh, but I am uh, I'm thinking about getting a, a webcam. Partner bought an RGB microphone. It's so distracting. Oh, yeah, I couldn't do that. I like it. I, I'm not really even a big fan of the RGB on my computer, and there's quite a bit enough of that already. Shut it down to reboot. Yeah, I've already closed, uh, I've already closed Steam and relaunched it. We'll try again. Just keep trying. Gotta get in here eventually. This is what you look like, not what I pictured you. See, that's what everybody says. Not how they pictured me. Download queued, starting download again. Backing, it's doing another... My god. <laughs> it's un- it's- it's unpacking. <laughs> but... 519 megabytes of 49 gigabytes. What's the point of preloading if I have to do a 49 gig install on launch day? <laughs> Study. We'll see. Bro, get into the stream. I can't. Can't. See, look here. I'll show you. Boom. Working. I mean, fortunately, my uh, my internet's pretty fast, so this shouldn't take too long. But it's uh, it's working on stuff right now. We'll get to the game as soon as I'm able to play it. We just gotta wait. 40, 49.06 gigabyte. It's like it's doing a complete new install, which again, defeats the purpose of pre-installing, but... What are you gonna do? <laughs> You're expecting some sort of genetically engineered fox in a top hat. See, now that would've been cool. This isn't downloading anything, it's hard drive dependent. I, I mean, I have two NVMe drives in here. Uh, so, shouldn't be requiring that, but I don't know. No, it's already, I don't know, it's already maybe 10% done. We'll see what happens. But yeah, it's probably a day one patch and stuff. It did a, it, it did do a download when I closed Steam and reopened it before, and, and now maybe it's just installing it. Look at the download screen. All right, download screen. Uh, <laughs> unpacking, 51.1 gigabytes total. Disk usage. Yeah, it's not downloading anything. It's actually just doing an install. In progress, at least. Something. Show you my stream setup? Uh, I don't really have, I can't. <laughs> Here's the thing. If I move this webcam, we're gonna have problems. Cause I, I had to like, 
I had to jury rig some lighting so I had some forward facing light for the stream tonight. Uh, and I have something taped to the webcam to the, uh, like diffuse some of the light because it was just too intense. Um, so I can't move it around. But I basically, I have two monitors, I have my microphone, and I have my computer tower. It's not really a, like a huge, um, not a huge setup or anything. Nothing super fancy. Use a mirror next time? <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. Look very carefully at the reflection in my phone. Okay, there's my monitor with steam on it, and there's the other monitor over here. You can sort of see that there. And then down here, too dark, but there's a keyboard down here. That's, that's part of the keyboard. <laughs> it doesn't exactly work. <laughs> the spells and special entering just for you. All the enemies are being reinstalled as bears and wolves right now. Oh, crap. One of those times you don't want to be special. No? Found the beer can. That's actually bubbly. <laughs> It's, I wish it was a beer can, but it's uh, it's just sparkling water. Nothing fancy. That worked better than I thought. Well, it was uh, that's just my work phone. It's sort of reflective, but it's got a dark screen on it, so it's not um, not perfect, right? Mm, beer. He also isn't. No, it's okay. I'm wearing pants. I have kids. I can't walk around the house in my underwear. It'd be weird. People start to say some really strange things about me if I was walking around in my underwear all the time. Kids around, you know? Yeah, I am going to use a controller. I have the uh, I have the Xbox Elite 2 controller here that I'm going to be using. Uh, and because I'm super elite, I don't use any of the extra paddle buttons, meaning that I wasted all of my money on this. <laughs> it is it is a little heavier, though, which is nice. And I feel like it fits in my hand a little better than the, uh, the regular controller, but... That's what we'll be using. Uh, I prefer using controllers for these types of game. I just find it easier. So we need Mrs. Fox to bring in the beer. Oh, yeah, we don't have any. We're uh, we're completely out of beer right now. Cider contain alcohol in it. If you get the alcoholic cider, there's also just regular apple cider that does not have alcohol, but you can get the hard ciders as well. I see two play button. Thanks. I got that in, uh, what was it, October, I think? Something like that. Where's the game? I'm waiting for it to unpack right now. So, uh, we're currently... Where are we at? Was that, like, 80% or whatever? 80% unpacked. Once it finishes unpacking, then we can launch the game, hopefully. We'll see what happens. It's supposed to be live as of 6 p.m. Eastern Time today, so... It should be live and available to play right now once it's done unpacking. Yeah, November, October, something like that. I don't remember exactly when, but got here uh it's normal you can't open the game yet still not available for me no it's this is unusual because it's a it's a game launch right uh, so sometimes it's not available to play instantly but uh i had to close steam and then reopen steam so that it would start the unpacking process to do the install for the game i, I did pre and pre-download it i thought it was pre-installed but i guess it doesn't install it right away and then uh on day one, there was a there was a small download earlier, and then now it's unpacking. So once it's ready, we'll get in there. I did do my my verify game files as well too. So we'll see. Restarted Steam. It's in process. Bitloads in Steam almost always require restart. Yeah, it's it's kind of a, a weird little hiccup or whatever. I figured it would be like something we had to do. So I had actually restarted I think twice before it started to install. Oh, yours just started and I'm you're finished. I'm jealous now. <laughs> I was watching Tag play this earlier today. I think, uh, I don't know, somewhere around 9 a.m. or something this morning. I just had this uncontrollable itch to play. One of the few, oh, there we go. Ready to launch. Oh my God, oh my God. See how it goes. 60%, you can't play it till 11 p.m. Oh, that bites. Play Elden Ring. Oh, baby. There's even an Elden Ring Adventure Guide. Because um, I did pre-order, but... I don't really have any need of the Adventure Guide, I don't think. I imagine uh, any of the player-created guides will probably wind up being better than the Adventure Guide they include. <laughs> Spartan 300, welcome to Mistakes Were Made. Thanks for clicking the Join button and choosing that top-tier membership as well. That's huge. 
Very generous of you. Thanks for the support. On game loading theoretically oh my god oh my god oops don't want steam in the way <laughs> here we go uh oh, delicious game audio Ooh, so looking forward to this This push any button, but my button's not pushing. There we go. Oh god, end user license agreement. <laughs> no, I don't care about this. It's accepted. Get me in the game. Face reveal, somewhat disappointed you aren't wearing a fox mask. Yeah, no, I don't own one, <laughs> unfortunately. Welcome to online multi -world, multiplayer world of Elden Ring. Oh yeah, baby. All right. New game. New game. Oh, that was it. I was expecting like a cutscene or something right away. Uh, I don't really need to do any of this fancy stuff. We can leave this all the same. Probably, you know, I probably should have checked the settings, actually, now that I think about it. Let's go into, uh, just really quickly. We'll check our, our graphic settings and stuff. Camera, display blood on, subtitles, sure. Master volume, music. I'm gonna turn the music down a little bit. Cross region play. All right, all right. Quality settings high. Is there a way to set those maximum? Bam! Crank it all up. I can go to the advanced settings too. Maybe we'll take off uh, motion blur. That oh, motion blur high. No, thank you. Let go. These are just high. That's fine. All right. Back it up. How do I back it up? <laughs> Get out of here. Back. There we go. All right, we're good. Half the time this controller is not working though. That's problem. That's problematic. Oh, it like disconnected, reconnected, or something. Come on, game. No, my controller is not working. <laughs> oh, there we go. Phew! Alright, we're in. Okay, select your character base. So, obviously, this is just what we're starting out as, and our choices that we make along the way are gonna change what we can do, but, uh, Vagabond. Oh, there we go. Okay. Vagabond starts at level 9. Uh, so the, the ones I'm... I'm not going to go through all the... Whoops. Oh, do not accidentally hit the B button. Run. Um, Alright, so Vagabond, Warrior. We got Hero. Bandit. The Astrologer is like the, uh, the hardcore... Uh, the hardcore mage class. The Prophet, I think, is the hardcore... Hardcore faith group class or whatever. Yeah, they got like the 16 faith there. Uh, we've got the Samurai, which is... Uh, Predominantly combat. He looks really cool. This is the prisoner. So the two that I'm, I'm kind of thinking of playing are... And there's the wretch at the end. So I'm, I'm thinking of playing either the prisoner, which is uh, combat-based but um, uses sorcery, or the confessor, who's combat-based and uses faith. Kind of leaning towards the, uh, the confessor, I think, for this run. And that just loops her all the way back around. Yeah. Oh my God, choose the wretch. Yeah, I'm, I will end up playing the wretch at some point, but if, uh, I, I don't want to. I don't want to choose the wretch right now. <laughs> I want to start with some kind of equipment so that we can actually get try to get some things done. Body type A or type B? I'm I'm assuming type A. My type A chose correctly. All right. 
that. Well, let's face it, I'm not young. Let's go with mature. <laughs> uh, Origin Confessor. So here's the list of keepsakes. Now, I, I didn't read through all of these to find out what exactly each one does. I probably should have. Oh, it actually tells you this one. Increases maximum HP. Lands between rune. The gold of grace shining the eyes of the people of the lands between used to gain many runes. Uh, said to reinforce sacred flasks. Ash of a small diminutive of goblins. Ash is said to hold. Alright. Cracked pot. Container for certain throne items. Stone sword key. It breaks the uh, seal on imp statues, but can only be used once. I hate those ones. Witching branch. Said to originate from the... Oh. Five sacred branches charged with beguiling power. Said to originate from the demigod Michaela. Who's, I'm going to take the unknown one. Because we never know where we might actually get to use it. We'll see. You obviously want the woe. <laughs> this is the one that increases your insanity, right? Crazed likeness of a noble whose eyes have been gouged out. Attracts enemies' aggression. Yeah, that's... No. No, we don't want that one. Let's go with the bewitching branch, I think. Because I don't know what it does, and it might do something neat. It might even be a boat. You know how much we wanted one of those? Uh, choose base template. Common face for all tarnished. Oh. Loner. Aristocrat. Seafarer. Reedlander. Guy yeah, looks entirely too handsome. What's wrong with him? Go the Reedlander, I guess. I don't know. Where blood is a familiar sight. Alright, we'll take the Reedlander as my face. Detailed appearance. Okay, so we can go through with, like, all this, like, crazy level of detail. I don't know if I'm going to. It didn't even give me a preview of what my mature voice would sound like. Get a fancy attire. Eat loincloth. It's not even a loincloth. It's like a... It's like a G-string or thong or something, man. Hmm. Whatever. He's fine. Good enough. I can't be bothered going through all the appearance. We're gonna put helmets and armor and everything on anyway. It's yeah, it's a banana hammock. A banana hammock. Alright. Finally. <laughs> I've been waiting for this for what feels like forever. How often does your guy go to the salon to get his waxing done? Gotta be relatively often, because he's he's got that tight-fitting loincloth on there, you know. Wow. The fallen leaves tell a story. The great Elden Ring was shattered. the Eternal is nowhere to be found. And in the night of the Black Knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Soon, Marika's offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. The mad taint of their newfound strength triggered the shattering. A war from which no lord arose. A war leading to abandonment by the greater will. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. The 
call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Oralu, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear, the deathbed companion, the loathsome dung eater, and Sir Gideon Ogmir, the all knowing. Yeah, that is a bit of a long intro. And that Sir Gideon guy was buried in a coffin filled with ears. <laughs> and he had a box full of eyes in his, on his chest. Mother, whom grace would again bless. A tarnished of no renown. Cross the fog. To the lands between. To stand before the Elden Ring. And become the Elden Lord. That sounds like a mistake. They're trying to put me in a position of power. Uh, if you're trying to launch the game on Steam and it's not available for you yet, try closing Steam and relaunching it. Uh, I had to close Steam and open it, I think, twice before it started to do the unpacking. Once it was finished unpacking, then it was ready to play and you could actually launch into the game. Uh, sorry, one sec. I'm just going to make a quick tweak to my stream setup here. To change over my feed here a little bit. There we go. Better efficiency. We're gonna need our deaths counter. We'll get that going, because Lord knows we're gonna be dying a bunch. Fine though. Alright, sweet. I'll try it on with the uh with the webcam on for a little bit because I don't normally use one very much. Uh and then uh I don't know, I'll probably wind up turning it off at some point. Okay, read message. Praise the Elden Ring! Oh yeah. That's <laughs> sweet. There's already bloodstains here. That's not promising. Somebody died in here already. God, I can't wait to find out what's going on! Harnished wizened finger. Okay. Nothing like collecting a finger on your way. Uh, though the path be broken and uncertain, claim your place as Elden Lord. Why did I collect the tarnished wizened finger? Light ahead. People are already leaving messages. This is another player here, by the way, that was jumping around. That white shadowy figure. If you're not familiar with the Dark Souls games... Joy, oh joy. If you're not familiar with the Dark Souls games, players can leave uh, messages using uh, a selection of words that are available. So you can't write anything, but you can write a message using the collection of words they give you. And you'll see them in the world uh, through shadows and stuff, unless you happen to summon them or get invaded. This is cool. Oh, there's the Erd Tree. Oh, it's over here. Of course, block shut. Of course, it is. So far, the control seems similar. Be wary of up. Okay. Let there be rolling. <laughs> uh, there's gonna be so many good messages people have dropped around. Look, if you go to a blood stain and you touch it, oh, it's not doing it now. It used to be when you touch a blood stain, it would show you the 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 person's death, so you could see how they died. Camera control, so right. Right, jumping. <laughs> beautiful. It is beautiful. Look at this. Character model looks great too. It's been, I think, five or six years since uh, the last Dark Souls game came out, so there's like... Fire Ed. Oh, yeah. You guys gonna say, like, Secret Wall, maybe? Precious Item Ed, yeah. 
<laughs> Everybody's coming and hitting the wall. <laughs> Good luck ahead, and then likely beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, so beautiful. I'm scout everywhere trying to find stuff. No down ahead. <laughs> The trouble is, like, so the tutorial messages that are going to be scattered in here look the same as the player messages. Be wary of something incredible. Didn't expect bridge. <laughs> uh, so I don't know which ones are actually from the game and which ones are from players, but people have been really busy. Make an ASMR video, Fox. I'm sorry, but I'm not, uh... Not female or scantily clad enough to make ASMR videos that will be successful. <laughs> God, I just want to see everything. Uh, why does that sound like combat? Oh, hey, buddy. Oh God, how do I roll? <laughs> it's rolling's not as easy. What? Well, there we go. Oh god! That's my face! I don't think we're supposed to beat this guy. Uh and I have no way of healing, so I think we're we're gonna die in the way that they're intending. Got it. Alright, that was quick. I couldn't roll. <laughs> it was a death, but not a real death, because it didn't say you died, because we we don't count this one. This is a land tutorial one, I think. on his side. We found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. Even if it does violate the Golden Order. All right, I counted it, but I don't think it really counts. <laughs> flask of Crimson Tears. I guess that's like the Estes Flask? Flask of Cerulean Tears. Okay. Praise the Elden Ring. Yes, yes, yes. Cave of Knowledge lies below. Up down there. What's this guy's deal? Talk to a ghost? Brave Tarnished, take the plunge. Of learning and remembrance. Recall the arts of war in your warrior's blood. Are they suggesting I'm supposed to jump? Is this a trap? It feels like a trap. Looks like we could get down there though. I want to see what's up here. This looks like a really small version of the Erd tree or something. Praise the great tree! What's left of it? Can I chop it? Why attack thing? Alright, so there's heavy. Light attack is not right button anymore. Though I don't know why. Do 
Still roll. Oh, A button jumps now. There's the jump button. She probably should have looked up the controls. Give up. It's, it's, it really is more like the Great Twig, yeah. Ooh, look at that. There's a thing up there. How do I get to that one? I wonder if they'd be... Well, maybe if we go this way, there'll be a way to get around. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not. I, I'm not gonna do French maid cleaning out videos, and just because they uh they do cleaning videos with a silky voice, <laughs> doesn't mean that's my a jam. Why is there only one attack? Couldn't there be? Hold on, let me uh, let's see. System. I'll go auto lock on. No, okay. It's so, uh okay. Strong attack, attack, R, right hand, and two hand weapon. So, right button should be working to do something, but it's not doing anything for me. Event actions, use item, backstep, jump. All the controls are the same as for Dark Souls. But for some reason, my right button does nothing. That's not promising. Oh, touch grace. So looking forward to a wax on, wax off video. Oh my god. <laughs> That's disturbing. This thing. Use stone sword key. I don't know if I should be doing that, so I'm gonna hold on. Oh wait, wait. That's uh these are the imp statue or the imp things that that um special item can unlock. But one of your starting items was the uh stone sword key. Cooperative multiplayer. Use tarnished furled finger to write a gold. Oh, that's why they gave me the finger. To roll the gold, write a gold summon sign. Cooperative multiplayer will begin once you've been summoned by a player from another world. You take the role of an ally, furled finger, or uh, and your objective is to defeat the area boss. Compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the summoner. Host fingers. Right. Oh, look, new finger severer. Does that mean if I find, like, people that I kill, I can just take their fingers? New tarnished, furled finger, yeah. Right. I really hope it's not a problem with my controller that I can't... Light attack, that's, that's not cool. Not cool, don't want to do heavy attacks all the time. Hey, seriously, how you doing? Looks like an elevator. <laughs> Need to know there's stuff in here. Pull my finger. It sort of takes on a new meaning, doesn't it? Good luck ahead. It'd be bad luck if I can't attack. Hold on, I'm gonna unplug my controller and try again. Where's the, uh... Okay, so that seems to be the light attack there. Where's the heavy attack on this one? Using keyboard. Oh, crud! All right, I did a thing I probably shouldn't have. You know what? Let's not let's not do that. <laughs> I did look up the keyboard controls. I'm good, thanks. Static. Now that there we go. Now I can light attack. For for some reason the button wasn't working. Better. Go. Get it. Get it done. Or get it done in one of the two. Very dark. I was buying the back triggers, uh, by the right bumper to see. Well, yeah, it was, uh, I don't know. I, I, maybe just the, uh, wasn't recognizing the controller for a second or something, but it, it just wouldn't let me do a, a right button attack, but it's, it's okay now. Light attacks are king. Golden ring ahead. So, I have a feeling this just leaves the area. I'm gonna go down and see if there's a way we can get into that lower area. Because it did say take the plunge. I wonder if they were being literal about it. Love the oxygen not included poster? Thanks, yeah, it's great. I got it from the, the, the clay website for Christmas uh, one year. Okay, I'm gonna go down over here, we'll see. There's gonna be there's so much exploring to be done in this game, I just... Getting started, oh yeah, can't go in there. Let's see if this will if this will chalk us up our first real death. Since the first one wasn't 
you know, it doesn't count. Okay. Using items. X use item and then switching. Skeleton. Alright. Ah, uh, fingers. There's another grace down here already. Sites of Grace! Resting at Sites of Grace will restore your hit points, uh, focus points, and cleanse any status ailments. It will also refill your sacred flasks. Over most of the enemies will be defeated. So the same as, uh, same as Dark Souls. So instead of bonfires, we've got these, uh, these sacred spots instead. Boxes up to dark controls. Maybe he's got dark plants. Oh yeah, it's so many dark plants. First enemy. Backstab still works. <laughs> I think I was supposed to heavy attack him, but we killed him already. Buddy. So... In order to do the jumping attack now, I think you actually have to you have to hit the jump button. Before it used to be if you push if you if you were like running forward and hit the attack the heavy attack button, you do like a jumping attack, but Sorceries and incantations. You can memorize sorceries and incantations at sites of grace. You must have a staff equipped to cast sorceries or a sacred seal equipped to cast incantations. So I think as a as a confessor we'll get incantations. Probably check my inventory here. What do we got? Uh, show large image and explanation, toggle character data, all right. Memory of Grace. The memory of First Grace, which once guided uh, bygone tarnished to the lands between. Lose all runes and return to the last site of Grace visited. It's merely a cycle. Stand before the Elden Ring. Become the Elden Lord. So the great part about this game is like all of the items have this lore embedded in them and you learn about the story of the game by like Reading all the items and stuff. Finger of corpse wax furled like a hook. Relic of those who came before, left of those who would come after. Uh, used to write messages. Oh, so that's what the uh, the tarnished finger was for, was the message writing. That's why so many people left a message in the first area. Like, okay, so we've got uh, urgent heal. Incantation of the two fingers faithful. Heals a small amount of hit points. This one can be castable in motion. Oh, that's handy. Two Fingers has high hopes for the Tarnished, that even if you th they should be wounded, even should they fall, they'll continue to fight for their duty. Assassin's Approach. Uh, completely silences footsteps of the caster, additionally reduces fall damage. So that's the same as there's a sorcery that does this as well in Dark Souls. All right. We got a broadsword. Skill, square off. Uh, skill starts with a sword held level, follow up with a normal attack to lash upwards through the enemy's guard, or a strong attack to perform a running thrust. Okay. Finger seal. <laughs> There's gonna be all kinds of, like, weird innuendo in this game, I think. This armament has no skill, the armament on the other hand has a skill that we... So this is for incantations. Uh, this shield... 12 poise, 109 discovery, memory slots. It doesn't, uh, doesn't show how much it blocks. Oh, there we go. Physical, 77. Guards against 100% of physical damage. Okay, that's good. Professor's hood. Alright, we don't need to go through all the gear. I'll have to look at all more of the gear and stuff later as we start to replace stuff. Guarding. Uh, use an armament in your left hand or both hands to guard against incoming attacks. Guarding is especially effective when done with shields. Guarding consumes stamina. If your stamina runs out, your stance will be broken. <laughs> I love that the audio is even the same as Dark Souls. Just thought of an idea. What if the shields had pockets? Oh my god, that'd be great. You can avoid enemy attacks with a dodge roll or backstab. Both these actions consume stamina. Lashed him. Could this be an item? <laughs> Except that it's not. 
So many trolling messages. So many trolling. Oh, jump. There we go. So weird to have jumping in the game now. I did it. <laughs> uh, hold the left stick and B to dash. Okay, we already figured that out before. They're getting shot at now. Wielding armaments. Each hand can be equipped with up to three armaments, allowing you to toggle between them. That's handy. Uh, switching. Okay. So, that's just all about switching switching weapons. So, it used to be before, it was all about dodging and getting behind enemies, but apparently there's a way to, like... Instead of, instead of just parrying, you can actually just block and stuff. Okay. Look at it. Is this guy just gonna guard indefinitely? Is that his job? <laughs> He's just... My job is to guard things. I don't attack. How do I... Ooh, wield something here. There we go. Got him. Handled him. Waited him out. How big is the map? Uh, I don't really know for sure because you, you... You uncover the map as you move along. You don't get to start with the whole map revealed. So as, as we progress forward, we'll find points that are going to let us, uh, let us... Oh, that's so cheating. Could this be a necessary item? No, it's not. Um, as we progress forward, we'll uncover more and more of the map, and then we'll get to see more of it, but... One bites the dust. Skills. Armaments have special abilities called skills. Skills are highly varied. Uh, and range of powerful attacks to the temporary. Using a skill consumes uh, FP. Well, yeah, except that the skill for the shield that I have... How do I... It used to be you could you could hit, hit Y and you would... Change, uh, change the dual wielding weapon, but I don't know how to do that now. Problematic. That's huge. Yeah, from what I've seen, it looks really big. Um, I haven't, uh, I haven't like poured over the whole map or anything. But there's also like an overworld and an underworld map. Crouching to make it harder for enemies to discover you, especially effective to tall grass. All right, stealth. Go, go, gadget me. I have trouble getting used to the whole stealthy thing. Oops. Did we stealth right? <laughs> Did a stealthy thing. See, hey, this is what Diablo is missing. Ah, oh, I see. Lump sort. Are you calling me fat? Can't get in there. Behold, enemy. Stance breaking. Uh, some attacks may break an enemy's stance, giving you a chance to perform a critical hit. Charge attacks and jump attacks make it particularly easy to break an enemy's stance. Hold right trigger to charge attack. Right trigger will jump. Well, we already figured out the jumping attack. So I guess we'll do a charge attack. Ash. Oh, yeah. It's like backstabbing, but for the, I'm covered in blood now, too. Just notice that. As I'm killing stuff, I'm getting covered in blood. That's amazing. Maybe used by the little things. <laughs> Stakes of America. Upon dying, you'll be revived to the last set of grace that you visited. However, there's a stake of America near uh, where you died. You can choose to be revived there instead. Okay. Or, kind of missing her arms a little bit. Try right, jump attack. Reverse the mist. Oh, good. A boss. Guard counters. You can perform a counterattack immediately after blocking an enemy attack. Guard counters make it easy to break an enemy's stance. Right trigger immediately after blocking an attack. Or we could just have him miss us and hit right away. Alright, that was easy. Enemy felled. 
So that new, uh, that block and counterattack mechanism is new. That wasn't available in uh, Dark Souls games before. He was watching the most annoying unboxing. <laughs> she specializes in watching annoying YouTubers. Uh, I'm one to talk. <laughs> Alright. Get out of here. Did we good with David? Uh, was it David that was missing his arms? I no, the statue of David is the uh, the naked one. Um, there's others that don't have arms. Oh, oh, now we're up above that spot. Okay, this is uh, the thing I could see up here that I couldn't reach before. The lower area is just a tutorial zone, I guess. All that for a gesture. And what are these about? No, no, don't do that. I need to figure out how to dual wield my weapon. Switch sorcery incantation, switch left hand armament right hand, switch item, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, vent action open, strong attack. There's no, uh, there's no option to dual wield here? There's gotta be. Gotta be. Huh. Yeah, I put one on the death count for the early death. <laughs> well, it'll remind you of your... Yeah. So I had... Uh, the first death wasn't really a death. It was like a planned one. That's a staged thing. You're, the, you're not supposed to beat the boss they throw at you. Although, I'm, I am curious what would happen if you did beat it. Maybe on a, on a subsequent playthrough, we'll, uh, I'll manage to beat that thing. Why left button plus right button? A weird combination. Well, that gets me... Oh, I see, I see, I gotcha. Oh, so if I do Y and right button, I'll do wield. Ahaha, <laughs> okay, thank you. Got it. Excellent. This tutorial, almost, uh, almost the good stuff. All right, we're getting out of here. Man, I'm strong. Welcome to the world between. Lands between? Lands between. <laughs> Get up our local grace here. Lost grace discovered. Alright, guidance of grace. Grace exists to guide the tarnished and lead them along the proper path. Even now, some sites of grace retain their power. The golden rays will guide you along your way. So there's like, there'll be like a golden beam that's, yeah, there it is. That stretches off of it and you can kind of see where to go. Use your map to check your current position as well as the train and surrounding structure. You can update your map with new information by finding map fragments that steals along the road. You can also use the map to uh, freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks. Helpful. Check our map. Where's the map? There's the map. Map menu. With the map menu, you can check your current position, yada yada, place beacons, uh... Lastly, through your map, you can select any set of grace that you've discovered and travel it. Oh, good. Fast travel. Nice. So, not a lot revealed to the map for us right now because we haven't found anything. But that's us. For steps. Yeah, I'm playing on PC. Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? Come to the lands between for the Elden Ring? Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. I don't want to die in obscurity. Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope. For even the maidenless, me, Vare. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace, the golden light that gives life to you, tarnished? You may also behold its golden rays pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace, the path 
that a tarnished must travel. Hmm. Indeed. Grace's guidance. Yeah, I'll try to turn up the voices in a second. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow, even if it leads you to your grave. Okay. Uh, let me just adjust the audio settings. We can turn up the. Uh, I'd like to. Oh, there it is. Uh, music, voice effects. Go. Okay, turn those up. Okay, so I think if I rest here, that will recover. I wonder if it'll make the blood stains go away on my clothes when I rest. Oh, it does. My clothes are clean again. Look at that. Not only do you get healed. You can memorize spells and stuff here. Uh, I only have two to work with, so that's moot. Sword chests. Uh, add charge to flask. Increase amount replenished by flask. Allocate charge flask shards. Can I use sacred tier to increase the hit points or whatever? But I don't have one, so that's... We can also pass time. So this does have a day-night cycle. There's different. There's things that happen differently at nighttime than what happened during the day. So I guess if you need to pass the time, you can do that. That's cool. Over here. Summoning pools. In each area, you may find effigies of martyrs. These effigies are summoning pools. You'll find it easy to summon other players at these locations as co-op and hostile summoning signs created with small effigies gather at summoning. All right. Okay, so that's a place to summon people if you want to. All right, I get it. Let's uh, let's. For now, I'm gonna take the path that Grace is sending us. It's uh, pointing us like right out this way. Directions that exactly? I think we're going to that church building to the north. Elder Ring, let's go! Yeah, I've been so excited to play this. Beautiful so far. This is probably a friendly guy on horseback, right? Because <laughs> guys wearing armor and wielding big weapons on horseback are always friendly. Oh, oh he's got a powerful hit from above. Uh, is this last one? Okay, there's our first death. Our first real death. <laughs> it's gotta be like that, is it? <laughs> uh... Them guys, it's big. <laughs> well, death. Oh, good. Upon death, you'll be revived the latest set of grace you visited. You'll drop any ruins in your possession at the time of death. If you die again before reclaiming... Okay, it's the same as uh, Dark Souls. Instead of souls, though, there are runes. Gotta go get my runes back. How rude. Okay, I probably didn't... Did I even have any runes? Shut up, goat. I'm sneaking here. Think you can see me? <laughs> Probably can. Oh, you know what? Uh, let's see. There we go. He used my first, uh, my first fate thing. Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> trying to sneak up on him, but that didn't work. Don't be me! Oh! This is not gonna end well. Look, buddy. I don't know who, who you are or whose horse you rode in on, but. Oh! But I don't like it. Go oh, fair. I want a horse too. This guy's like a boss or something, a tree sentinel. To kill your horse, buddy. Then you're gonna be upset. You won't have a horse. Well, that took a lot of stamina. Oh, he got me in mid-jump. <laughs> Push for the jump attack. Oh! Thought I was dead. Okay, nope. Nope. I 
gonna do it. number three. <laughs> oh, this is going to be ugly. Ugly. I wonder if I'm even supposed to be fighting this guy yet. He's supposed to kill it. Paraphrase Ron Weasley. Oh, thanks. <laughs> what? Kill it. Need a bow. I, I could have cheesed it if I had a bow because it was stuck on the rocks. It couldn't get to me. He's watching me. I don't like him. I got my roots back at least. First blood! Oh! Oh god. Oh god. His first blood was worse. Probably shouldn't be messing with this guy. <laughs> oh. Listen, can we talk about this? Oh god. Put a stop on me, man. It's so rude. Maybe I'll sneak by this guy for now. <laughs> uh, he's big and mean. I don't like him. Four deaths already. What are we, uh, just like half an hour in? <laughs> Not even half an hour of actual play. All right, I'm going to grab my stuff. We'll sneak by him. We'll come back and kill him later when uh, I feel more able. The only challenge with blocking money charges is that it, uh, it sucks up all my, uh... Sucks up all my stamina. Where's my grace? Oh, it's back here. Red. I got my, got my sneaky shoes on. We'll be alright. Never hear me. Where is it? There it is. A little hard to spot. Got it though. I think they got a couple good attacks on him before he before he gets me. Oh, he ran away like oh, that's cheating. Oh, why didn't I just why didn't I just avoid him? Okay, that's not blockable, apparently. Oh, God. <laughs> he's like, he's like, it's empty. That is slow. Oh, I do have a death wish and a suffered streak. I got both. We got both. All right, uh, I'm skipping him this time. I swear, this time we're skipping him. <laughs> it's 
So much, so much for that. Death count five. All right. Uh, so I learned something, at least. Uh, casting healing spells is super duper slow. Yeah, it said it was an urgent heal, but it didn't feel all that urgent when I was doing it. At least not in terms of, like, a speed. <laughs> I got my, uh, I got my silent shoes on. Get out of here. We'll find him later. Might need to level up a little first. Not really doing a lot of damage. Face cam! I did have my face cam on, but what happened to the face cam? I don't know, I turned, I've had it on and off a couple times. Kind of spicing it in and out, I guess. Uh, fast travel to Sites of Grace. Yeah, 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 we can fast travel. So it's like it's giving me a second tutorial. That's weird. We'll deal with this. Strengthen armaments. In smithing tables, you can spend runes and smithing stones to strengthen your armaments. Somewhere the lands between, you may meet a, a blacksmith who can make your armaments even stronger. Smithing stone. Nice. Be wary of dragon. <laughs> it's... Scary looking mount right there. You're a tarnished. I can see it. And I can also see Right off when I'm picking my nose. <laughs> after my throat. Then why not purchase a little something? I am Carly. Purveyor of fine goods. Yeah, I'll put it back Goodbye. on for a bit. Oh no, I didn't mean it. Oh shoot. Alright. Alright, purveyor of fine it? goods. Still going to put to sell about Kale. Of a nomadic people, selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. Uh, I went with the Confessor class, so I'm a mix of melee and faith. Uh, purchase sell recommendation. You know, if you can spare the rooms. You should buy yourself a crafting kit. A crafting kit allows you to make basic items on your own. Oh, that's handy. Essential, really, if you intend to survive out here for any duration. The kit costs a bundle, and I admit I do take my cut. But the important thing is that you survive. Every customer counts, after all. Yeah, the cloak effects are great, and they actually get blood on them too while you're fighting. So as you're killing stuff, they get dirty. It's kind of cool. Uh, all right, let's see what we can buy here. Uh, throwing daggers telescope allows viewer to see far away things. Imagine that. Pearl calling finger remedy reveals co-op and hostile summoning signs. All right. Crackpot crafting kit. It's three hundred for that. How much have I got? Five ninety-five. Yeah, let's buy it. The vendor says it's important to have it. We should buy it because they would never lie to us in the interest of making a sale. Note, Flask of Wondrous Physic. Note, imparting knowledge in brief. Oh, are these like recipes? Flask of Wondrous Physic. It's like, as in a physicker. Physicker. Healer guy. Alright, let's, uh... Crafting materials, bolstering, key items. Missionary's Cookbook. Fans crafting repertoire. That's a thousand. Fanatic Warrior's Cookbook. All right. Purchase item. This ones are just info. Note of pairing. Uh, well, I'm, I'll buy it. I mean, it's, it might be. I don't know what it's good for, but hopefully it means that I can now craft something to, like, heal myself. Out of stock. And I don't want to buy it. All right. I'm glad you took my warning to heart. I did. Thank you. you. Made an excellent choice. Can I kill you now? Uh, item crafting. If you have a crafting kit, you can make various items from materials that you find. Select item crafting from the main menu to make items. You can learn to craft more items by finding cookbooks. Containers. You'll need crack pots or other containers to craft certain items. You'll not be able to make uh, more of those until you have the containers. 
Container items will run out with use, but the containers themselves will remain. Okay, so we'll have to get more containers, I guess. Can I craft? Item crafting. Item crafting menu. You can make various items from uh, materials that you find. You can learn to craft more items by finding a cookbook. Uh, so what do we got? Fire pot. Roped fire pot. Throw behind to inflict fire damage. Oh, that's neat. So as you're running away, you can throw a fire pot behind you. That's great. <laughs> Bone darts. Roll a raisin on horseback. Uh, feed to torrent to restore hit points. Oh, that's helpful. Rainbow stones. Okay, it seems like that thing that I found didn't really do anything for me. Unless it's in my inventory. Nope. So whatever that note thing was, I spent 200 on. Oh, there it is. Note imparting knowledge and brief. Let's examine. Note sold by a nomadic merchant imparting knowledge and brief. A flask of wondrous physic will remain in the third church of America north of the Mistwood. Cross the highway bridge and follow the animal trail north. Oh, it's like a treasure map. All right. But without the map, it's just like a note describing where I'm going. Third church of America north of the Mistwood. Cross the highway bridge and follow the animal trail north. Alright. Alright, the path for this one's pointing off to there, so let's go see what this has in store for us. We don't need no stinking torch. <laughs> so here's some berries. We can acquire those. Every quarter of the land between, you will find fruits and flowers, mushrooms, and butterflies, and various other materials. They can be for crafting. So that's the row of fruit. I guess that's for making the raisins. Need more fruit. Hello, got now. Oh god, my button's not working again. What the heck? Yeah. <laughs> that's great. I don't know what's going on with this controller. I think I might need to swap it. Hold on a second. Try a different controller and see if this one works more consistently. That's super annoying. Oop. Oh, Piggy. No, I still can't attack. What is going on? Uh, are we able to play online on Xbox yet? Uh, I don't know. I think if, uh, depending on what country, uh, what time zone you're in will affect what, uh, what you can do. Button settings. Armament. Attack. Yeah, like, why is it not working? Might be a bug in the game. That's that's a big problem. If I if I if I'm hitting the button and like there's nothing happening, that's that's not cool, man. Not cool. There is multiplayer, but it's like drop in, drop out multiplayer. So the multiplayer in Dark Souls takes the form of summoning uh, summoning other people to come and join you in a fight. If you summon them before a boss fight, they'll. Uh, They'll disappear once the fight's over. I literally cannot attack. This is not cool. All I can do is heavy attack right now. That's that's not what I want. That work. I want to restart. Yeah, maybe I might have to. Erdly flower. Heck, is that noise? This is the animal there. I oh, look. It's a tortoise. Gold tinged excrement. Oh, good! I got poop. That's awesome. Why is there always poop in games? I don't understand.
<laughs> Doesn't do a lot of damage, but we'll get through them. Change the button used for attack. I mean, I don't know. It's super used to using a turtleneck meat. All right, gross. Okay, hold on. I'm going to I'm going to go back to this church building here. Uh, we'll log out there and then I'll log back in and see if it sorts itself out. Behold, rump. Did you know there's a giant bear in those woods? He's looking. Oh my god, I've seen the pictures of that giant bear. I do not want to mess with that thing. Just saying. Pause then alt tab. Oh yeah, maybe that's the problem. There we go. Yeah, weird. Okay. Maybe it might be because I clicked out of the game because I was over uh, clicking stuff on LBS. Phew. All right, good to know. But we gotta go this way anyway. Let's kill this guy a second time. Bug's been in the game since DS1. Really? That same one? That's so funny. Pretty good, uh, pretty good gathering range. I didn't have to be that close to pick that thing up. Oh, I cast it twice by accident. I love how I'm a confessor and I've got like this assassin's ability. That's amazing. Ooh, Kukri. Ruin fragment. Okay. Got more up here. I don't know if I can reach that though. Oh, it's gonna be so weird to be able to climb over objects in the game. Oh my god. <laughs> All, every other Dark Souls game, like if there was if there was a pebble in your path, you were stuck. You couldn't go over it. Now we can finally climb. That's gonna take getting used to. Mushroom. I guess this is still kind of a tutorial type area almost. Oh, uh, maybe not. I thought this was a, like a, a, a friendly encampment, but I should have known better. It's Dark Souls. Tried to hit me from behind. Okay. Oh god! Oh god! Ah! It's a different button to pick things up now. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, we found magic mushrooms already. Hooray! Whoops. Could this be treasure chest? Except it's not. Teasing me. Good friend. Ah! Oh. He interrupted my uh, my counterattack. Ow, oh, that hurt. We talk about this? Healer? Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh, you brought a friend. You brought a friend. are teaming up on me here. Oh god! Get me out of here! Oh no! I'm dead! I'm dead! <laughs> There's a lot of guys over here, man.
Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Bow! Gonna be a lot of that, I think. So was it worth the wait? Oh, we're still really early into the game, but I'm gonna go yes. I'm gonna say yes. Uh, take America. How close is that one to where I died? It's gotta be closer than the, uh, than the other summoning point. You block it with your body, you got this. Oh man, I made them wear out their blades all over my, my body. It was great. At least we spawned like right near. Get better stuff. Well, we've only just started playing. We will get better stuff. And we'll get better at playing the game. And uh, we'll figure out where different things are that we want to check out. The learning process, you know? Gotta start somewhere. I guess since I died, all these guys respawned. Ashley with the super chat, you body blocked like a pro. Good job. Thanks, Ashley. <laughs> I've been practicing that body blocking for uh, just for such an occasion. Hey, lone wolf. Oh. Why do you bring friends so quickly? Miss me. Oh. Alright, didn't miss me that time. Next half for the win. He drop. Uh ooh, a spinning stone, nice. No, that was not what I meant to do. All right, shield boy, let's go. Ah, you know you can't hit them when they're getting up. The hole in the ground here, I wonder where that goes. Try to wear these guys out from the outside in. We'll get some of the ones over here that came and joined the fight before. I just did my stealthy thing, but now the guy's coming. I'm the guy with the shield first. That's that's the plus. Found a chest. Ooh, a flail. What's the flail, I wonder? Uh, ooh, I can't use it. Uh, looks like it scales best off dex and, and then strength, and we need a dex of 18 to be able to use the flail, which I do not have yet. Who carries the torch in the day? I don't know, maybe some guy that wants to light other people on fire? I don't know. Game's gorgeous. Yeah, so far so good. I mean, we've only seen such a tiny little bit of the world so far. Already thoroughly impressed, but then again, I was also eagerly anticipating the game, so... I'm probably easy to impress. Godric Soldier's Gauntlet? They're wagging over here, we might be able to loot. Look at all these skulls on the ground. Why so many skulls, bro? Yes, <laughs> this guy's a horrible guard. He should have spotted me already. Not that I'm complaining.
Lord Sworn's greatsword. Eh, right. What was down the stairs? I'm gonna go and look, but uh, I'm kind of like working my way around here trying to kill off as many of these guys as I can. Uh, before I get right into the middle of them all. with our assassination skills. Ooh, brass shield. And bolts, too. Ruin fragment. Be interested to just find out all the different kinds of things we can craft, too. Let's see how long it takes to actually cast a healing spell. Uh, that was relatively quick. Felt a lot slower the first time we tried it, in the middle of a fight. When someone was trying to kill me. That might have had something to do with it. <laughs> oh, somebody spotted me this time. He's not very quick about it. Come along, friend. Before your friend joins the fight, I don't want to deal with him and you. Oh god, no! But I think I killed all his friends, so hopefully that doesn't make any more spawn, because that would suck. Tried to roll, it didn't work. Ow, jeez. Stop with the multi-thrusting, you jerk. Not dating. <laughs> the sword does not do anything to stagger. <laughs> it's not great. Ooh, it's raining. I thought this game had dynamic weather. Ooh, we did it. Okay, so they can do the block and uh, block and attack move also. God, I feel so weak. Come on, friend. Don't be like that. Oh, jumped right over him. <laughs> Lead skills. <laughs> Vanquishing enemy groups. Vanquishing an enemy group will replenish your flask. The number and type of flask uh, to be replenished depends on the enemy group. You cannot replenish more flasks than your maximum. Oh, sweet. So because we took out this entire camp, it refills all my flasks and I don't have to go and rest. Uh, I don't have to go and rest at, a, at one of those grace spots. That's so cool. So when you do something challenging now, you kind of get rewarded for it. That's great. Okay, so we added to the map now. New map has been found. Limgrave West. <laughs> there's not... There's no in-between. It's all out or all in. <laughs> uh, oh, nice. It even shows the path of the, uh, the thing you gotta follow. Grace. Okay, let's see what's in that, um, that underground spot here. Curious about that now. Let's deal with this. Oh. Golden Rune. There's a chest ahead. I feel like they're lying to me. Oh, there is one. How about that? Yeah, I love that it, uh... I love that it refills the flask when you take out a group, because it's sometimes one of those things where... You don't want to get engaged in the fight, because... You're gonna use up all your flasks and then have to go and reset everything. Uh, with a whetstone knife, you can use Ashes of War to grant your armaments new skills at Sites of Grace. Armament can only have one skill. Any skill it previously had will be removed. 
Armaments type determines what skills it can have. Special armaments have unique skills that cannot be granted new ones. Okay. Adding affinities. With a whetstone knife, you can use Ashes of War to grant affinities to your armaments to Sites of Grace. Make an alternate armaments attack affinity, boost uh, attribute scaling, and more. Armaments, armaments type determines what affinities it can have. Some special armaments like those, uh, those with unique skills cannot be granted new affinity. Ash of War, War Stomp. Whetstone knife. Alright. Man, so much to learn. So much to learn. Never played a Souls game, might have to be the first one. If you're gonna pick one to play, this one would seem to be a really good option. And if you're planning to buy it on PC, I have a link in the description down below to where you can get it on my Nexus store. Uh, and that helps support the channel at the same time as you get the game. I think with Nexus what happens is you, you buy the game and then you get a, a Steam code that you redeem. Uh, okay, there's, there's a Grace over here. Check this out. Xbox 2, awesome. Uh, alright, rest. Oh, I probably shouldn't have. I just reset that whole camp. <laughs> we're, gonna have to, we're gonna have to navigate around those guys this time. Uh huh. Greetings. Traveler from beyond the fog, I am Melina. I offer you an accord. Have you heard of the Finger Maidens? You think it's a Honda Accord? They serve the Two Fingers, offering guidance and aid to the Tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are maidenless. I can play the role of Maiden, turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. You need only take me with you to the foot of the Erd Tree. I mean, alright. I don't want to be able to level up, I guess. Summon me by grace to turn runes into strength. Ah, another matter. I bequeath to you this ring. Spectral Steed Whistle. Use it to traverse great distances. It will summon a spectral steed named Torrent. Torrent has chosen you. <laughs> Treat him with respect. There are going to be so many inappropriate jokes about the whole finger maiden thing, let me tell you. <laughs> He's a two finger maiden. I think there's three finger ones also. <laughs> uh, but they're like a different type of magic or something. Uh, okay, so we can pass time, we can level up. Class, we can memorize spells. Oh, well, let's do the uh, the level Shall up, I guess. Turn your runes to strength? That'd be handy. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Remember, do not accept gifts from the one-eyed woman. <laughs> your ambitions. The principles you would follow. Okay, so the weapon I have scales off a of deck, so that's good. Uh, and then we also have faith we can boost. Although, so what does faith get for me? Looks like it increases my defensive stuff. I'm not doing anything else right now. And then Arcane. Boost Discovery, whatever that is. What's the one that affects my focus points? I want. Oh, let's see. Can I get. How do I 
boost my focus points. The mind? Ah, mind. There we go. Okay. Let's put it in Dex for right now, because I'm not really using a lot of faith-based stuff at the moment anyway. Aside from, like, sneaking around and stabbing people in the back, but... Put a couple points in Dex. Boost our, our damage with our sword a bit. One figure made but she's rude. <laughs> No, uh, no, they didn't release Elden Ring early. It's about uh, it's about the the system that you're using and then the time of release. So this one uh, for PC it was available starting at 6 p.m. tonight. Uh, console it's available starting at midnight tonight, and that time frame is dependent on where you are in the world. So for me in, in Eastern time zone it was 6 p.m. when it was available, and then um, you know if you're in a different part of the world overseas you might already have access to the game on console as well. Uh, I charged a flask. No, I don't have that stuff. All right. Okay. Can I ask her questions? This is Ashes of War business. With the Ashes of War menu, you can use Ashes of War to grant skills and affinities to your armaments and sites of grace. Armament can only have one skill, and skills that previously will be lost by blah blah blah. Okay. Rest Hunter Shield. So, this would give me the ability to have War Stomp. Which doesn't really tell you a lot about what it does. <laughs> I'm, I'm assuming I stomp on the ground angrily, but there's got to... Is there a... Oh, detailed view. There we go. Nope, that was not helpful. Huh. Really doesn't tell you anything about it. All right. Oh, it's nighttime now, too. This is an actual RPG. RPG. I've never played a Souls game. It's um, they're they're kind of light on the RPG elements. It's really more of a skills-based combat adventure game, um, and the uh, the story of the game is more unveiled in the things you find and the people you talk to and the spells that you uh, snippets of information you get in spells. Really more, uh, really more like an adventure game. Use the Spectral Speed Whistle to summon and ride your Spectral Steed. Uh, if you're stu if it dies, you can summon it again, but it will cost you a flask of crimson tears. You can discount using the whistle again, or by pressing blah blah blah. So how do I use the whistle? Oh, pouches. From pouch in the main menu, you can equip six items to your pouches. Four of those can be used without opening the main menu. And a pouch one, two, three, four. Oh, that's okay. All right, interesting. So, like, if I want to ride my steed, how do I how do I set up the pouches though? So those are the pouches there, but I, I need to figure out how to set those up now. Those are quick items. Where's my pouches? Arcane is a dump stat, is it? I think stone. Did it tell me how to configure the pouches? Did I just not really pay attention? Oh, wait, hold on. If I go here, how do I, how do I change it though? Switch, ah, there we go. Speed whistle. Ah, okay, got it. No, I don't. Oops. No, 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 no. All right, I want to change that one to uh, for an enemy to inflict damage. Sure. Well, no, I want that on my other thing. What's this? Small gold effigy. Whatever. I'm sure, it's fine. Okay, so now if I go like so, I can hit this and summon my steed. Oh, so cool. He's got double jump. It's like a mix between some weird goat thing and a horse. <laughs> it's not... He's not all horse. He's not all goat. He's a happy medium. Oh, there's bats. What the... Alright, so we can sprint around on the horse, so that's good. <laughs> that's cool. 
Wait, was that the guy I fought before, or is that a different guy? That's a different guy on horseback. Oh, what happened there? <laughs> Why didn't I use my sword? Oh, let's try that again. All right, I can see that sword-based combat, or uh, horse-based combat is going to be tricky to time. Seems like I always attack on the right side, too. Oh, oh, God! Oh, man, I, okay. I ran into his torch and burned my horse. <laughs> that was maybe not the best plan. <laughs> we got to work on the uh, the horse-based combat, though. That's, that's going to take a little practice. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to get you out on fire there. That was inappropriate of me. Who's this? It is open world, yeah. Bird's eye telescope. You use a bird's eye telescope found in various areas to get a bird's eye view of the train and the direction that the telescope is facing. All right. Oh. Oh, wow. All right, so we got a dude on a bridge. This looks swampy down here. Oh my god, this is so cool. Oh, there's, oh, there's multiple Erd trees. Oh no, that's the Erd tree. <laughs> These must be like little saplings or something. It says we can look at the direction the telescope's facing, but it does let you look all the way around, which is nice. Nice. Cool. Let's try to let's try to lock against some bats. Oh wait, we can fight this guy. We see if we can die. Haha, <laughs> surprised your horse. Whoops. Uh double chap <laughs> for the record. <laughs> go, go, go! Double tapping jump makes your guy jump off for the record. Flash the bat. Okay, so you swing downwards with the sword first and then up. Certainly makes that interesting. <laughs> I'm undercutting his horse. Leave me alone. Hope this horse has infinite stamina. <laughs> That's rude. Uh oh. Oh, where's my shield? I didn't mean to use that. Ah. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have got on my horse. Oops. Kicked me right in the face. That was awesome. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Well, that didn't work. I want a rematch. I wonder if I cast... Oh! Okay, when you're on horseback, you can attack the different sides using... Okay. I get it. So, uh... What you would normally use for uh, other abilities, you. Ow, that hurt again. And that kick really hurts. Oh my god! Oh, I wasn't dead. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think he killed my horse. Oh, poor horse. Oops. <laughs> we're gonna rack up a lot of deaths while we're figuring this out, I think. Oh my god. Oh, we lose time when. Uh, we die too, it seems. It's, I think it's later in the day now. Oh, we've died eight times. It's well, seven if you count the uh, if you don't count the first one. Oh, 
Oh god, that hurt. Oh boy. Killed your horns, buddy. Oh, that's cheating. My horse get this. <laughs> My horse doesn't summon itself. Wow, come on. Where'd it go? My horse left on its own. <laughs> There's a big bald spot with the super chat. Horse up to the face equals ouch. Yes, it does seem to, doesn't it? Rotten horse foot to the face. We're gonna get this. If I have to kill my horse a hundred times trying. No, this uh Souls games are definitely no joke. Right. Oh, that was I see what's the problem is. So you dismount. Uh you dismount by pushing into the left control stick, and unfortunately, sometimes when I'm when I'm stressed, I hit it by accident. Oh! This the horseman combat's awesome. And despite the fact that I've been losing. Killed your horse, buddy. Oh, I killed him too. Ha ha ha. Finally. All that for a sliver of meat. Is that it? Well, I got some souls. Um, well, not souls. I guess it's... Uh, oh! Oh, I lost my grace before, didn't I? Because I died and didn't recollect it. Ah oh, ha ha. Hope I didn't lose a lot. Oh. Ten deaths? Did I forget the increment one? There we go. Come along, my trusty seed. I heard a guy talk to me when I was over here before. I don't know what the deal was with that. I wonder if it was like a nighttime event. Oh, wait a minute. A double tapping B made me jump off, but double tapping B just puts you in like permanent sprint mode. Cool. You're good. For whatever reason, Rabbit started death counter. Oh, was it wrong? Hold on, we'll back it up one. Didn't work. <laughs> Should be going down now. There we go. I don't know what these relic things are for, but I'm assuming we'll be able to build something with them later. Oh, I can kill birds. Feathers. Didn't get far, did you, bird? Oh my god, this horse is amazing. Oh god! Go, go, go! Maybe I shouldn't be messing around with horse-bound combat so much yet. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing. I can double jump, though. Oh, that hurt. Go, oh, come through. One down. Oh, he's brought friends. Maybe we should cheese it. This is uh, probably gonna be, oh, there's my grace. Gotta get my runes back. Out of here. 
<laughs> oh, nope, not so out of here as I thought. Go, go, go! Oh, how far is this guy gonna chase me, I wonder? Come on, friend. <laughs> that didn't work so well. Can't follow me. Yes, you can. All right, get out of here. Oh, wrong button. Oh, no. That's going to happen so often. <laughs> oh, now we're at 10. Rabbit was right. He was just uh, a little ahead of the game. Ah, uh, uh, oh, the same thing I saved at. <laughs> the horse combat is fun. That's neat. Where did I die? Clearly, I need a little practice on my horseback fighting. What happens if I kill the goats? In beast bones. <laughs> okay, uh, if we go back to the grace, it should have another marker that will point us in roughly the general direction we want to go. Because right now I'm just running around like a fool. Oh, actually, this one doesn't have a grace marker. He was back here in the woods. Kill the goats X amount of times to spawn a monster like in Witcher 3. <laughs> it seems like they're just there for the purposes of gathering uh, crafting materials. What are you? <laughs> You're dead. That's what you are. Beast liver. Gross. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. Oh, <laughs> okay, that's not so good. Take your stuff, thank you. Root resin, all right. God, I love this horse. This thing's amazing. Ooh, what have we here? Sending gate ahead. Groveside cave. Yeah, I yeah, I am not a liver. <laughs> I'm a dire. Summoning pool is now functional. It occurred to me we had to actually touch the summoning pools to activate them. That's well, they look friendly. That's a lot of wolves. A lot of wolves. I need to heal. I'm getting further in the cave. This is bad. Oh yeah, that was definitely bad. I thought the guy was there with them, but nope. He got killed by them. <laughs> Oops. 
I thought I could uh, sneak around the wolves with uh, silent feet, but that didn't work. All right, clearly I need to exercise more violence. Not caution, of course. We don't do caution around these parts. But more violence we can exercise. All right, increment my death counter. <laughs> well, for those of you who were uh, who were hoping we'd see some uh, some wolf deaths, there you are. That was some big whipper. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, he didn't jump as far as I thought he would. Hey look, we're up to 12 deaths already. Sweet. Lost my, uh, lost my runes again, because part that way. I thought there was a wolf, like, right below there that... Can't see it. Ow! Stop biting me! I think I need to turn on my auto-targeting. Because I'm dying, or, or I'm, uh, I'm killing something, and then it's not moving on to the next target, and I'm having to hit it. It's messing me up. Ah! Oh. Uh. That's a big wolf. That wolf's like a mini boss. <laughs> we'll get it. Day one, things are sloppy. Yeah, cave boss. all this stuff could this be something incredible well it's wolves and they ate my lunch uh back to full health I think that healing spell that I can use in between fights will be really oh you know what I should do is while well, I'm thinking of it uh, auto target on, toggle auto lock on. Try that. So hopefully it will, uh, when I kill an enemy now, it'll swap to the next one that's immediately there. Build your friend. Yeah, it did that time. That's good. That's what I want. No one whimpered when I died. Almost felt bad. Almost. Raise the bug. Silver fireflies we got there. Oh yeah, we won't be putting away the death counter just yet, don't you worry. <laughs> this guy with messages on his head. Legs. Head. <laughs> I have no idea why I'm in here, but this is fun. What's the ghost thing? So when you see the ghostly figures of other people in here fighting, those are other players who are in the same the same zone at the same time. And you're catching glimpses of their other world. Oh, this is a boss fight. Uh, hi, what are you? 
Oh, oh no. It's like some weird werewolf kind of thing. Take my stamina back. Thank you very much. Oh, that sucked. He's some raging. Get me, don't get me, I need to heal. heals. I want to be able to cast a heal, but that would be bad if he hit me while I was doing it. Got him. Whew. Actually, the Super Jack, go Beast Man. You can do it, except he didn't. Flame Drake Talisman we got off that guy. I don't know what that does for me, but... Uh, did it heal me up? No. There we go. Hold on. Hey, Tank, how's it going? Oh, you must be so far ahead of me by now. You had like the whole day to play. I had to work all day. I was so jealous of you earlier. <laughs> I was like, oh, I want to play. Return to Endurance. Oh. Okay. I guess this is... Is there no other way out of here? I guess it just... You could run back through the quarter if you wanted to. Alright, we'll take this. Killed it right after the stupid stream first try. Nice. That figures. <laughs> Always right after. Was it your first time playing a, a Souls game, though, Tag? Because I got the impression you hadn't played one before. Hey, seriously, how you doing? Or Triple Hearts, rather. You were here earlier. I'm slow. First time ever. Oh, nice. Good first game to start on. This thing's beautiful. Uh, I'm going to level up, I guess. So we got uh, 14 decks. Put a little more in there. Actually, you know what? I kind of want some endurance. <laughs> I feel like I'm running out of stamina a little bit. Oh, actually, endurance also helps equipment load here. Where in Dark Souls 3, you had to have like a separate thing for your equipment load. That's a bonus. First time ever, I suck as anticipated. Well, I mean, that's to be, that's a given with this game. Like it seriously needs practice to get good at it. And I'm not good either, but I have played before. <laughs> Can't play these Dark Souls kind of games. Say I don't own that many controllers. Oh yeah. Dark Souls 1, I broke an Xbox controller. That was frustrating. Who's tagged back TV? Uh, he's another YouTuber. He's got a, he's got a channel that's got uh, just shy of a million subscribers. I, uh, I found his channel first uh, quite a while ago when we were we both happened to be playing the same game at the same time, um, Ancestors. I stumbled across his channel and uh, every now and then I drop in and watch some of his content. He's got a cool telescope too.
Okay, I have no idea where we need to go. That's the kind of the best part about this game is it's so non-linear, even compared to the other Dark Souls games. That looks like a cave over here. Put a marker there. We'll go check it out. <laughs> Poor lady's got no arms. Who's the heathen running around stealing all the arms off the statues? That's what I want to know. Oh, oh god. Oh. Actually, can I jump down there on the horse without getting hurt? I wonder if you can, like, jump and then jump again right before you hit to avoid taking damage. Firing Minds want to know. Nope. <laughs> For the record, if you fall too far, you don't get a second jump. <laughs> Ah, uh, it's massive. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do in the game at the moment. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, now you don't have to test it. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> I wonder if my souls will be at the top or at the bottom. Or not my souls. My, uh, I wonder if my runes will be at the top or at the bottom. That's, uh, that was not ideal. <laughs> I really thought I could, like, do a second jump right before the ground, but, uh, better to know now than later, I guess. Oh yeah, the death count. Sorry, I forgot, forgot to increment our death counter. <laughs> oh, that was fun. <laughs> well, we needed to know, you know? It's it's valuable information, and now we know. Knowing's half the battle. The other half is red and blue lasers. Make your flesh there, piggy. Oh, you know what? I want to go mess with that guy that killed me earlier. Not because it's the smart thing to do, but just because I want, oh no wait, I want my, I want my, uh, dude, I gotta get my runes first. Can I even get down there to get them, I wonder? Oh, I missed. Missed the birds! Guess I gotta go around the end here, maybe? Except you're about to jump off a cliff, call a friend to talk you out of it. <laughs> well, I, I was curious if it would let me... Do my second jump, because the horse has a double jump. Thought maybe I could do it right before hitting, but, um... Game said no. Die! There we go. I'm bats. Ooh, you're a jerk, aren't you? Oh! Okay, that didn't really hurt too bad. Little dragonfly things around here. I don't know if they're supposed to be something you catch or what. Oh, God! <laughs> All right. They're mean. That's what they are. Come here, you jerk. No, it didn't work. Who are you in, though, you sucker? All right, note to self. Watch out for the dragonflies. The soldier drop stuff? Uh, what's up there now? Uh, it's all right. Most of the stuff they're gonna drop is just gonna be junk anyway. Out here. Yeah, they're like the mosquitoes in Valheim, but they're not. Uh, they're not as as harsh. I'm gonna assume they're not. Oh my god! Crap! Uh, surprise dragon! Alright. Uh, that was insane. It killed my horse and me, like, instantly. Um, <laughs> we're not messing with that thing. Holy. Wow. Uh, yeah. I did not expect that either. That was. That was wholly uncalled for. Wow. Alright, note to self. Don't go down to here. 
Uh, oh, actually, I, I'm gonna have to go get my souls back, or not my souls, my uh, my runes back. But it looks like um, it put them at least in a safe spot, away from where the dragon is. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need we're gonna need a much bigger sword. That dragon was huge, man. The dragon's small compared to one of them, man. That's both awesome and terrifying. Thanks for sharing. It looks like you can only do the... Yeah, there's like a point where you're all, you're falling down again. Where you, oh wait, there was uh, something here. What oh, was a message? That's what it was. Probably like beware dragon or something, what? Why is it always bog? Yeah, question. Eat it, bat. Oh, I almost fell in a hole. What was that? It really was a hole. Oh my god. We got here. Spinning stone. I'm guessing falling in here is not a good thing. So lonely, but hole required ahead. <laughs> do it. I don't want to do it. You become a mod? Sorry, but I don't just, uh, I don't generally randomly promote people that ask for mod. And we died a little bit. The dragon's still out there, too. That's great. Alright. Guess now that it's here, they're like, surprise is over. We'll just leave it out. Fine. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I just wanted my stuff. Whew. That's scary. That dragon was awesome, though. Even though it killed me. I guess that's why there's a cave back there. It's probably for the dragon. By the devs for that concept. He's enormous and authentic. Cool. Yeah, that's uh That was a really cool dragon. Oh my god, one hit dead. Right. <laughs> he had a distinct reach advantage. Oh, all the way back here again. That guy is a boss, I don't know. It's weird to have one like right after you leave a, the starting zone though, like... Probably just a tough enemy. Almost like a mini boss kind of thing. Game's full of bosses, yeah. But well, there's not only is there bosses, but there's mini bosses, right? So it's like you got you got those types of situations, but then um, like the full-on bosses, like that dragon, guaranteed has got to be a boss. Can I level up? Runes needed twelve thirty-eight. I don't even. Oh no, never mind. My runes are on the ground. That was stupid. Of course I can't. All right, look here, Bub. I need my stuff back. I feel like fighting this guy on horseback is not good because I can't block. So we'll try the... Uh, try to fight him on foot again. And there he is. He spotted me. I want my stuff! Oh, that hurt. That was uncalled for. Oh, God. Oh, 
Oh my lord! Fight for the floor with me! And I'm dead. <laughs> Gonna just leave this boss low to level up perhaps. I could. I could. I keep messing with him because he's there, right? Just want to kill him because he's there. We'll have to. I'm, I'll come back and get him another time. We'll leave our 492 runes over there. Unless I can just ride in. Ooh. May I have a word? I says pardon. A pleasure to meet thee, tarnished. I am the witch Rena. Oh. I'd heard tell of a tarnished hurtling about atop a spectral steed, and upon looking into the matter, the talk I surmise is of thee. Thou art possessed of the power, no? To call forth a spectral steed named Torrent. <laughs> I kind of called the spectral steed. Let's just lie to her. <laughs> ah, as I had hoped, I was entrusted this for thee by Torrent's former master. Ooh, spirit calling bow. What's that do? New lone wolf ashes. It is a bell for calling forth spirits. Summon them with it. From ash and return to the earth tree, the spirits will obey thine command but briefly. Oh, okay. As they recall battles past, now it is thine to do with as thou wishest. The spirit calling bell, you can use ashes to summon various spirits. Summoning typically consumes FP. You can only summon one type of spirit at a time. You cannot summon spirits during multiplayer, right? That's cool. Forgive mine intrusion, Tarnished. I doubt we shall again meet. She's got two sets of hands. But all the same. Learn well. Oh, well, look at her. She's got like, uh, that's, uh, there was How a screenshot of this that came out. Wonder. She's got like a spectral face. Tire of obeisance to the two fingers. And she's gone. Huh. Okay, that's cool. Oh, let's, uh, can I upgrade my weapon here? Can we trust that lady, though? Probably not. Strengthen our armaments. Uh, all right. The smithing menu, you can spend runes and smithing stones to strengthen your arm uh, armaments. You can strengthen your armor up to plus three at a smithing table. Some of the lands between, you can meet a blacksmith that can help you do. All right, so let's, uh, oh, wait, do I need, <laughs> I need runes, and I left them all on the ground. Because <laughs> that's what I did. All right, I gotta get my, I gotta get my runes back. She was a 20-finger maiden, yeah. I'm out of here. There's foxes there. I messed up with that guy. I wonder if he can ride in here. Maybe I can cheese him a little bit. She probably gives great back rubs. Yeah, probably, yeah. Among, <laughs> among other things. Uh, let's get broadsword plus one, I guess. That bumped my damage up a little bit. And then we need two more smithing stones because we need a total of four before we can do it next time. Neat. So funny to see your face when the dragon comes in. Man, that that uh that dragon, that that was something else. I was not expecting that at all. <laughs> Alright. Follow the path, we'll see what's over this way. I think this this path pretty much just pointed me right to where that encampment was that we cleared out. Maybe there's uh, something inside that, like, the st there's a big door over here we can go through, maybe. Oh, there's another Grace over here. There we go. Yeah, she's probably amazing at birthday parties. Absolutely. Just think of the magic she could do. Sleight of four hands instead of just sleight of hand. Uh, okay. So it's pointing me off this way now. Giant head. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, wait, I was... Oh, no, I saw this. <laughs> Not surprised me this time. I saw Tag do this earlier. Spoiled a surprise on myself by not, uh... <laughs> not staying away from someone else's stream. That's why I don't watch other people too often. <laughs> I'm gonna fight him, but those archers are kind of a nuisance. Come on, buddy. He's a biggin'. I wish I could get them to shoot this guy in the back. That'd be helpful. Come on, friend. The size of this guy. Try to step on me, man. Oh, oh, that hurt. I just don't want the soldiers to join in this fight. That would be really inconvenient. Oh, that hurt! <laughs> oh, again! Shouldn't be going for that extra hit. Oh, he's got the sword out now. Okay, that hurt. A little slash on him. Ooh. I think I blocked. Come on, jerk. Ha <laughs> ha Alright, cost me a few flasks, but we got him. Woo! I got big. Wait, what's that little marker on the left side there now? We got like some weird gravestone thing. Okay. Attacks to the groin are always the most powerful of attacks. <laughs> oh, you don't. Korean Beast Surcoat. I could see me here. Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he spotted me. <laughs> Love all the bosses don't just have one special attack, they have a variety. Yeah, and they, they kind of change around, right? Good. That's... I mean, that's that wasn't even a boss. That was just a big, uh, big-sized enemy, but... Oop. He shot his friend in the back. Funny jerk. Ooh, how'd that not hit me? I like that counterattack thing, that's really handy. Golden rune.
Is there a tutorial area? Yeah, there is a little a bit of a tutorial area right at the beginning. It, it only gives you a rudimentary idea of what to do in the game. In terms of, like, how to jump and, you know, light attack, heavy attack, that kind of stuff. It's not a lot of detail in there. There is definitely one. Found some bugs over here. I wonder if I can catch these things. I can. Smoldering butterflies. Yeah, these messages here are all left by players. Try luring it out. Oh, wait a minute. Does that mean there's something else here? Rat ahead. Right? Yeah, there's, um... So there's an item that we can use to write messages. Uh, I should probably equip it, actually. Put it in, like, uh... Whatever, this'll work. Plop that out. It's this finger here. This one here we can use to write messages. And so when you do a message, um, you have to actually pick from like a selection of, of templates, like blank ahead, no blank ahead, be wary of blank. Um, so you choose your template and then you and then you plug in the word that um, sort of suits the message you're trying to get across. So a lot of them are joke messages. <coughs> Excuse me. A lot of them are joke messages that people will put out there that'll be like, Need head kind of thing or whatever. Like there's just all kinds of weird stuff you'll get. Um but yeah, they're cool. It's kinda of like a funny way of communicating with the other players that are oh god. Oh god, there's all kinds of guys here. This didn't tell me there was a party. Put a dress better. That guy's got glowy eyes. That seems problematic. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm out of healing. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention to my health. <laughs> Let's just get down here. <laughs> I'm out of magic. Uh, all right. Do here you say? I'm wearing confessor armor now. It does 8.8 uh, defense against physical, and then it's got some uh, some resistances and stuff. It weighs 8.3. But here is an improvement in most ways, but it's also heavier. I think I'll still be medium load, and I'll get oh way better poise off it actually too. I don't know if I can disguise myself, like they won't know it's me. I guess I'm gonna have to poise 25. <laughs> Foot soldier cap. Bumps up my equipment load too high though. Alright, where'd they go? Glowy eyes is toast. He knows it's me. <laughs> oh, I cleared out the camp. I got my uh, I got my flask back. Nice. Well, I got one back anyway. I guess it was just a small one. Soldier dive athlete's foot. <laughs> That's a random thought. Stormhell. We've got a golden seed. What is this thing pointing me to?
Nice, another smithing stone. What's this guy's deal? Offer. <laughs> oh, hey, wolves. That was, uh, unexpected. One down. Oh god. I'm down. <clears throat> I can't get used to the fact that I can jump. This is crazy. <laughs> no, nah. I don't know how to manage myself. What's the blue marker? Uh, that was a waypoint that I put down. So when I was when I was on the map, I uh, I clicked here and I put a waypoint down because I was curious where this uh, where this thing led to. Whether there was another um, another gray spot up here, but uh, I don't see one. Where are the bears? There is a giant bear somewhere. I've seen a screenshot of it. I don't uh, I don't know where. I've been fortunate enough not to see it yet. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Is that your friend? Oh! Interrupted my attack again. Oh god, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh, he's got friends. Okay. Oh god, I got some health back. Yeah, we killed the doggos, but that was, uh... What is that screaming? A better shield and sword. Well, the sword is a function of whether I can use it. So the great sword um, requires 16 strength. So I don't have enough that I can use that. Uh, and this shield here is also a high strength requirement shield. Um, it does have some better protections than what I the one I'm using in terms of like magic and fire and stuff. But it's uh, both a lot heavier uh, and uh, requires more strength. So I can't actually swap out to that shield or that uh, sword. I have to boost up our stats before we could use those if I wanted to. There's another one of those giant guys over there. Oh god! Nope! 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 <laughs> uh, slashing and riding. Not, not good on Cliff Edge. That was maybe not a... That wasn't my best idea. I think that might be the most common thing I'm going to say while playing this game. Oh god! Look, there's a whole field of those giants out here. Wow. Oh, what are you? That doesn't look promising. I don't have any healing and I'm all in a magic. I, I kind of want to uh, find another gray spot that I can activate and rest before I try messing with something like that. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's like an inchworm. Ooh, are these all runes in here? 
Grave robbers now. Can't grab that one. There we go. Whoa, 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 <laughs> no, thank you very much. Okay, those are dangerous. Got it. Um, get out of here. No idea where we're supposed to be going, and that's kind of cool. I guess because we'll just ride around aimlessly, lower a little bit. We can follow the road, that might help. What's our horse's name? The horse's name is Torrent. Nope. Peters. Bunch of I got no life. Uh, you know what? I need, uh, really need a gray spot that I can rest at. Oh look, those uh, inchworm things are like standing up like... Kind of like sentinel post kind of things now. They're weird. Did you name the horse or did the game? It was the, uh, the name of the horse in the game. Why, 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 why? <laughs> Get me, I'm out of here. Look at the size of that thing. No, I'm not here. You just ignore me. <laughs> the thing's huge. Okay. We could have taken him. <laughs> I have no healing. <laughs> Not only would he probably have splatted me, but I, I literally can't heal right now. Oh good, there's another Grace here finally. That's what I was looking for. Oh, thank goodness. The cat looks very friendly, probably just wanted to hug you. Yeah, that's the trouble. You can never trust a guy that wants a hug on the first, uh, first time you meet them, you know? Always trouble. Especially when he's 20 foot tall and has a giant axe-like thing. Ooh, a stone sword key. Uh, hi? Everyone's... been grafted? Everyone who came with me? They crossed the sea for me. They fought for me. <laughs> Only to have their arms taken. Their legs taken. Even their heads taken. Taken and stuck to the spider. Did you know if you're grafted by the spider, you become a chrysalid? It's quite a lark when you think about it. Okay. You're all on your own, are you? And heading to Stormvale Castle. Enticed by the one in the white mask, I suppose. Oh, you've come to be one with the spider. 
Well, that makes us two peas in a pod. But I don't have your courage. It's scary, you know, having your arms cut off. Or legs. Or your head. I want to be like everyone else, but I'm just too scared. I'm nothing but a craven. Wait, they willingly had their limbs chopped off? And their head? It doesn't seem very conducive to a long life. Huh, that one's pointing that way, but there's just a stone wall. It must be up at the top. Crazy. Alright. We ride! Oh, actually, now that I got this, uh... This lost gray spot here, I wonder if, uh... If whatever that swamp creature is is still down here. Alright, the wolves. Forgot about them. Keep accidentally clicking the right joystick, which makes the, uh... Makes the horse go away. Oh, that's my horse! Rotten wolves in their ambush. Okay. Oh, it's, it's a little solid. Maybe I shouldn't mess with that thing. Oh, yeah, I definitely shouldn't have. <laughs> What's it doing? Am I even doing damage to that thing? Maybe I shouldn't be doing this. <laughs> I have a knack for picking fights I shouldn't. Let's just get out of here. Where was that swampy area? Gaming noob, talk about. The Pokemon Onyx, yeah. <laughs> Where the heck was that spot? I was riding around all over the place and I kinda didn't really make note of it, but there was a spot that had like that swampy, oh, down here probably. There we go. Onyx, that is, yeah. I tried to fight a Pokemon. Didn't work very well. Ooh, that didn't treat me very good. I'm assuming this thing's not going to appreciate me killing off its. Whatever they are, babies or such. <laughs> it definitely didn't. Ooh, what is that? Ugh. It's like a mass of tentacles with a beak. God. 
crashing me. Ah! Can't target it! Oh boy. I'm doing like no damage. There's gotta be a weak spot on it, maybe. It's not a boss. Maybe I gotta attack it from behind. Nope. Okay, you know what we need to do is go away. I'm not messing with that. No, thank you. All right, it's right up the road here, I guess. We'll see what's up there. Spaghetti can't be evil. I don't know, it looked like evil spaghetti to me. I'm I'm in agreement. Evil demonic spaghetti. Oh. I did not ride the direction I thought I did. Go by himself. Maybe we can take him on. I think he's broken. <laughs> I got no flasks. Oh, this is not the fight I should be in. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have messed with that guy. He was maybe uh, a little big there. The wee little one. Yeah, I didn't have a flask. I didn't realize my, uh, my flask were all gone. Probably better to fight him on foot. Because then I can block a little bit. Oh. Hello, Gapna. Oh, God. Alright. That's cheating. Ghibli ones. Right in the mommy daddy button. Fox, the point of the game is to not die ingloriously. I don't know if I believe that. I think you're supposed to die a lot. Kind of the nature of a Souls game. I mean, ideally you want to succeed, but it usually involves a whole bunch of death first. He's got a few different moves. That's neat. Oh, that one I don't like. It hurts too much. Don't like that one at all. Don't stop on me. Oh, this reaction stop is quick. <laughs> Oh, 
Ooh, that was close. Got him. Whew. This. Strength Knot Crystal Tear. I don't know what that is. Let's see. Not here anywhere. Temporarily boost strength in maxed physic. That's maybe like a crafting item? This is a key item, but... I don't know. Weird. Okay, uh, where was that, uh, this point? Let's go over here. Alright, we'll teleport. That works too. Hey Fox, use your spectral wolf call. Uh, call will help. I haven't tried that out yet, I guess I should. See how the, uh, the whole spectral summoning thing works. Um, I want to level up. To use those runes before I lose them. The bigger they are, the higher they can reach on the thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I missed all of them. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Clearly, I need a little work on my uh, mounted combat. down and dizzy you know what let's just kill him this way there we go <laughs> right around in circles getting a dizzy man Why did I not upgrade my strength? Because the, the weapon that I'm using right now scales better off of decks. Or does it? Huh. I don't know. Maybe I should look at strength. What have we got here? What the heck are you? Like a crazy dung beetle. Back here. Ash of War, wild str Oh god! Didn't you see him reading here? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, He's got a big ballista up there or something. Ballista or a catapult or something. I didn't like that. Like a grenade launcher. I wonder if I could sneak in there. I'm gonna guess no, just by the fact the guy just called for help. Oh god! <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh, good thing I was crouched down there.
Ooh, they got a lot of friends. Somebody shooting at me. Oh, miss. Ow. They'll never see me here. Too much damage here. There we go. Uh, can you lead them to the exploding arrows and kill them with AoE? Well, I think it was actually these guys back here that were launching them, so I'm not sure. Maybe. A little bit late now. I kind of killed a whole bunch of them, but. I bolts off that guy. Never see me coming. Going all stealthy now. Well, that didn't work at all. <laughs> Not that I was entirely expecting it to, but. Oh, missed. the launcher oh oh run oh that sucked <laughs> leap attack is great but uh i don't like i don't like this guy at all he needs to go jerk I wonder if we can take control of this thing oh wait can we can this be a necessary item uh there's messages here but I don't think we can take control of it that sucks that'd be great if we could grab that thing and start like launching them at the guys ahead of us down there only two more deaths till the party starts here we're getting there we're working our way up to our 20 death requirement Seek light or seek death. There's a lot of blood in here. Ill-omened creature. Give up. There's also a uh, grace here, though. Hmm. Oh, I don't want to pass time. Carpenter XL with a super chat. Get busy living or get busy dying. Never mind, just seen death counter. Oh yeah, we were up, we got 18 deaths already. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat though. Messy. Just a little messy. Summoning pool is now functional. Okay, this is cool. Foul tarnished. 
in search of the Elden Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Jump! Someone must extinguish thy flame. Do we have to? Let it be Margit the Fell. In the oh, oh. All right. Alright, Margaret. Maybe it is your real name. Ooh, that hurt. I don't like Margaret very much. Good deal, Margaret. Oh, oh those things hurt. Even when I block. Strike. I wonder if I can chop his tail off. I don't really want to fight him near the edge if I can avoid it. Heels already. Oh, you can't dodge while you do. You're casting spells, apparently. Here it says with a super chat. Thanks very much for that. Travis with a super chat as well. Sorry, I'm trying to pay attention to this guy. Wow, can we actually put a face with a voice? Yay, about time. Thanks, Travis. Appreciate the super chat. Ooh, that was mean. He can jump off the edge and kill himself. It'd be kind of handy. Oh, God, that hurt. I'm out of magic. Need my the rest of this flask. Oh! Ah! Oh, I... I tried to switch to my shield, but it didn't swamp over. Nice job, Cryptic Brave Webcam. Kudos. Well, thanks, Cure Six. 19 times. That's another death. Okay, I want to try out this uh, this whole summoning thing. I haven't done that yet, actually. Um, how do we do? Just set that thing up. Oh, that's interesting. We can't put the bell in there. Um, how do I active? How do I use the bell to summon? Oh, have I got to use it here, maybe? Oh, wait, here. Touch golden summon sign. Sorcerer Roger. Summon cooperation. I thought I could summon ashes, but let's summon this guy in, I guess. Roger, Roger. Yeah, we're an expert at body blogging. <laughs> I had the, uh... The healing thing out, I guess. My infinite wisdom. Alright, come on, buddy. Okay, we got... We brought help this time. That was not friendly, buddy. Ow. Get him, Roger.
went down there for a second. I need stamina. Oh, what? What? Warrior blood must. Must be like a second phase. He just pulled out another weapon. Backstab. Got me as I was trying to roll. That sucked. Yeah, that other guy's an NPC you can summon to help you with fights. Um, that didn't work out. All right, two attempts down. We can beat this guy. He ain't so tough. Although he does have a big shining yellow hammer that's uh, smashy smash. Oh wait, I forgot to mark my deaths. <laughs> there we go. Now we can officially have fun. We've got 20 deaths. Oh, you know what? I didn't get my, uh... Didn't collect my runes back the last time ever I died. No, I got none. Go me. That didn't work. This is not going well. <laughs> this attempt is a wash. <laughs> the NPC is just getting thrashed, too. That dagger thing hurts even when I block it. Especially if I don't block it. So much for that guy. I really need to heal. That'd kill me. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. You have shorter hair than your last web again, but still handsome and bright. Well, thanks. <laughs> yeah, significantly shorter, because the last time I used my webcam was uh, in the middle of COVID, and I hadn't been, I had a haircut for months. Normally, I get my haircut like every four weeks, so it stays nice and short. It's, uh... When the things are open again, it's significantly better. Oh yeah. Gonna up that death counter. 21 right now. <laughs> Did I summon him? Yeah, there we go. Travis, another super chat. What's your death goal tonight? Or should I say, what is the pool at? <laughs> I have no idea what the goal is. I mean, aside from, uh, you know, many deaths and having fun, but... Oh, oh I was using the wrong... Roger alone. What did he ever do to you other than shoot you with spells? Ow. Ow. I like this guy much. Roger's so dead. Ooh, he's down, he's down. Get in there. Rat. Thou art of passing skill. Warrior blood must truly run. Oh my god! Oh, 
Oh man, he's just thrashing me. <laughs> that big hammer is brutal. <laughs> ah, sweet. Well, so much for that. What about the wolves? I wonder if the wolves would fare better. How do we, uh, how do we summon things with Ash in this game? Summon three lone wolf spirits. How do I use that? So there's that summoning bell thing they gave me, right? But I, I don't know where that is or how to use it. Bell that summons spirits from the, uh, alright. So do I switch display? Oh, capable of summoning various spirits. Uh, spirits, um, spirits can only be summoned in the vicinity. I wonder if I have to. Do I equip that in place of my summoning scepter thing? Maybe that's the issue. I, maybe I have to actually equip it here. No. Oh, oh my God! I got talisman. Boost fire damage negation. Yes, please. <laughs> Didn't even know I had that thing. All right. I don't know how I'm gonna use it. Whip or remove. Oh, there we go. There we go. I guess I could just use it in the fight or something. Now, I can't do it when I've got this guy helping me, but. Eh, we'll try him again. Another game where the only defense is to roll and is roll versus everything. Well, no, you can block and stuff too, obviously, but. Uh, rolling is the one that. Um, the gate's the most damage, generally speaking. I was stuck there. Damn it. Come on, Roger, we got this guy. Got a magic sword. Jealous, Roger. Jealous. Backstab. Man. Oh, Roger's dead. <laughs> He's standing toe to toe with the guy that was over. Bring out the wolves! Get him, wolves! Get him! They're hanging back. Get in there. <laughs> out, of, out of healing. So dead. <sighs> that was a little bit better than before, but still messy. I wonder if those ashes are fully consumed if I use them in that way, or if I could use them more than once. Firing minds want to know. Yeah, dead again.
Say I'll be at 27 before I beat the thing. Well, we'll be lucky if we kill it by the time I get to 27. <laughs> now, the only tricky thing with summoning another guy to help this way is that it increases the difficulty of the boss as well, I think. Like, they get more life and stuff. Because there's now two of you fighting him. I think it works the same way with the NPC summons as it does with uh, player character ones. worth backstabbing there. I think it's better just to let Roger tool on him a bit. Oh boy. jerk. Ow. I, I, I didn't mean it. I was only joking about the jerk thing. Put these foolish ambitions to rest. <laughs> oh, that dagger he throws sucks. Okay. Yeah, it's always the the bosses always get the most dangerous as you get closer to the end. <laughs> yeah, we're climbing closer to the twenty-seven. We're at twenty-three now. Come on, friend. Dolo Diecast with a super chat. A dollar for each death so far, and two for the handsome guy pretending to be cryptic. <laughs> well, thanks for the super chat. And the backhanded compliment. <laughs> oh. Oh, that sucks. Need to get hit less. Funny how that works. Try to jump attack him more often because it breaks down his poise and then he stumbles. Look, we got him stumbled to get some free hits on him. Uh, right until that. Ooh, that hurt. Blood must truly run in thy veins. Guy's got too many attacks and too many limbs. Speed. Oh, Roger's so dead. 
Oh, nice. with that jump attack as you leave yourself undefended for a second. That's me. Oh, that did miss. until that point. Uh, is this the first boss? Uh, no, there's been, uh, what, um, I don't know, maybe one, two others. The first one you fight is, uh, we found this uh, we, um, in a cave. It was like this serpent guy. Maybe it's the second boss. I don't know. I don't even know if this is the guy we're supposed to be fighting right now because it's, it's all open. You can kind of go where you want. So, for all I know, we might actually be Messing with something I shouldn't be yet. Is this hell mode? <laughs> There's no difficulty settings in, uh... In Souls-type games. Everything's all the same difficulty. Bad dog day, though. Same thing, he's going for the jump attacks too. <laughs> oh, that's way too early for him to be dead. my wolves. Oh, that hurt. Need like an obstacle I can stand behind so if he throws his knife thing at me. Oh, got no mana. Dead. Got me drinking from my flask. Come downstairs, mom in law watching Elden Ring on an 80 inch screen and some weird chunky monkey is playing. <laughs> weird chunky monkey? I'm not sure how to take that. <laughs> Good lord. The fat comments tonight. It's starting to hurt my feelings. 
Here, 25 deaths. Am I? There we go. Neglected to bump it up a little bit. What's this thing do? What's a bewitching branch do again? Use FP to charm pierced enemy. No idea what that does. All right. There's a prisoner. God. I'm gonna heal way too early in the fight. Smack me too much. Those shots miss. Oh, I'm so dead. <laughs> I was gonna kill me while I was healing. Heal already. Well, now on to the passing skill. Warrior blood must truly run thy veins. Get him, wolves! Oh my god. This guy is just tuning you. If it when I block, I get hurt. Here goes the wolf. Oh, Lord. It's got smoke of me. Maybe we should, uh, yeah, I'm getting worse. <laughs> I'll try it one more time, and if we don't beat him this next time, then we'll, uh, we'll leave, we'll come back and attack him again another time. We don't have to fight this guy right now. He just happens to be a boss that's in the vicinity. One more try. Come on, Roger, we gotta do this. Do you have something that gave you more strength temporarily? Uh, maybe? We got... Crafting. Oh, I haven't tried to craft anything. Maybe I should try to do some crafting. Number of runes. I don't think so. Threat enemies to uh, inflict damage and build up some. Build up onset of blood loss. How do I craft? I am crafting. I make fire bombs. Reveals co op, but no, that's no good. We can make fire bombs, I guess. Smoldering butterflies. Fire pot. Guess that's it. What was that one fire pot I made? That's lame. Yeah, one fire pot. I'm Let's see how much damage it does. <laughs> He turns in midair. That's cheating. Yeah, the very first move and I had to heal. That's gross. Oh, 
too slow. I wonder if I could like hit him with like one hit and then go for the backstab. So that way Roger can still hit him. near the edge. Oh, he's so dead. Warrior blood must truly run in thy veins. Tarnished. with my bare hand. That was not intentional. God. No, no! Wanna heal? Pretty much my last heal, I think. Oh, oh, no, oh, no, no! <laughs> Almost knocked me right off the edge. There's no way. There's no way. We're gonna take some kind of damage through my shield here at some point. Or like that. <laughs> Parry? I, I have not figured out the timing of the parry again in this. <laughs> heal. I tried to heal. I used it all up. Alright. I'm gonna come back later. We'll, we'll fight this guy another time. Maybe when I'm, uh... When I'm feeling better equipped. <laughs> no, you can't summon the dogs and the mage at the same time. I think it said that you can only have one at a time. Why couldn't I... Why couldn't I backstab that guy? God. Ooh, that was close. I hear you met a drag. Oh man, we rode into this little swampy area and it came out of nowhere and just like obliterated us. <laughs> like, like just instantly. It was really cool, but it was also very deadly. Travis with another super chat. Nice job. Better luck next time. Thanks, Travis. Appreciate the super chat. Looks like I guess I guess once we get past him, that's when we get into the castle. So maybe there's there's got to be some stuff here down these other areas that we can we can tackle. <laughs> Missed him. Four HP benefits all class builds, but the damage of finishes the fight fast. Yeah. I mean, the whole game is. What, what the? Look at that crossbow. Uh, the whole game is just a whole. Like, constant set of balancing things out, right? Those, uh, that wolf ambush again. I guess that's not a singular event. Oh, we can try this guy. Oops. Do that. Let's try the big, uh, the big giant guy. I just want to save my, uh, save my respawn point over here so we don't have to ride all the way back down again.
forgive me. Oh. I've been testing you to see whether or not Grace truly does guide you. <laughs> uh oh, I think we failed. <laughs> whether you are fit to face the challenge that entails. It seems my worries were unfounded. Torrent had your measure from the very start, whereas I merely pretended. There is but one other thing I can do to offer you guidance. I can take you to the round table hole, gathering place of tarnished champions, guided by grace. Uh, all right. Very well. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. Now where are we going? Round table hold. The round table holds a place where tarnished gather, guided by grace, comets prohibited on the premises due to the pact of non-aggression. Rules in effect when the round table icon is displayed. Round table is located outside of this world. It can only be reached through sites of grace. It can also be accessed by using the map to travel. Oh, that's cool. Wait, yeah, we got pocket horse. Oh, I see you've just arrived. I did. Welcome to the round table hold. I'm Corin, a man of the cloth. I teach incantations, the strength granted us by the two fingers, and explore the secrets of the golden order, so that one day, if a tarnished of the round table hold should become Elden Lord, I might counsel them, ensuring order regains its proper form, writing rule over men. By the way, do you still see it? The guidance of grace. Uh, sure? I do. Wonderful news. Most tarnished are blind to it these days. You are something of a rare breed. Darn right I am. What do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? <laughs> oh, so many jokes hiding here. So many jokes. Study incantations. Okay, oh, sweet. Uh, urgent heal we already have. Just regular heal. Heal set points for self and nearby allies. That's kind of cool. Cure poison. Increase magic negation. Increase fire negation. Rejection. Produces a shockwave that pushes away foes. Could probably use that to knock people off cliffs and stuff. Catch flame. Momentarily sparks, sparks flame in the hand. But what does that do for me? Flame sling. Throw ball of raging fire. Oh, yeah. We need some of that. Need some of that. I don't have any, uh, I've only got 197 runes, so I can't actually afford anything. <laughs> order shine through you. Look on the table, though. Kind of a cool place. That door is blocked shut. In here. Man, somebody really needs to hire a maid. This place is not well cared for. <laughs> a new gesture. What do you want? <laughs> Was that all that person's there for? Just to give me. Alright. Could this be a teacher? Maybe later. Probably not now. That's twisted. Twin Maiden Husks. Purchase, offer, a bell bearing. Runar grants the blessing of an equipped great rune upon us. Cypher Ring when invaded. Request the aid of a hunter. Answers request for summoning from hunters. Also, oh, this is for PvP stuff. Increases memory slots. Those are key we got already. This about. 
Post trick mirror. Take on appearance of a cooperator. Oh, that's cheesy. So you look like a cooperator when you invade somebody's world and then backstab them. Yeah. Door ahead. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> they make it so you can't open the door. I can't, uh... I can't use my right button attack again. Oh, never mind. I can't attack at all right now. Solves that. Ah, hello. You must be new here. I'm, well, just call me Dialos. The Dialos. owner of one's house holds little import in these lands. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant. But fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. If you find her, please be sure to tell me. Is that the lady that was talking about grafting onto people or something? Bob Ross with the upgraded membership. Upgraded mistakes are made. Thanks, Bob. Appreciate the support. Thanks very much. Be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman named Lanya. She's a servant to yeah. my house. She's been my companion since childhood. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to find her like this. Honestly, she's such a little tomboy. <laughs> you learn the incantation wrong. Order of the two fingers requires you to bend over while learning. Uh, but I'm bummed. I'm telling you, there's, I, I, I'm not sure how they arrived at that naming. Oh, look at this dude. But uh, it was just ripe for jokes as soon as they came up with it. You're on your <laughs> face. No matter. It's all the same. Lay out your arms. Let's get smithing. I don't want you pounding my arms. Ashes of war. About the chains on your legs. Chains. Oh, there they are. I see you've noticed the chains. Nothing special. I'm a prisoner and these are my chains. Fix my counter? What's it supposed to be at? By the hold. I'm dying smithing for you fools. <laughs> That's all there is to it. All right, you're a prisoner? No, don't read too much into it. I have no grudge against you. My being a prisoner is no fault of yours. Besides, I don't mind smithing. Despite my differences, the weapons get stronger all the same. Is it 27 we're supposed to be at? Technique never fails. Besides, it helps me forget. The sheer terror of her. Can't decide what class to go to. Too many good ones. Yeah, I mean, bear in mind the class choice really only affects the very beginning of the game because as you start to level up, you could just dump your points in another spot and effectively change what you're doing. It's really more about your starting point more than anything. Uh, Ashes of War. Ash of War duplication. Oh. Usable on axes and hammers as well as curved uh, swords and great swords. Colossal weapons accepted. Bond strikes heavy. Storm stomp. Quality. Usable on all melee armaments. Okay, I don't have enough to strength. Oh, I can strength this thing. Fire seal plus one. Can't scaling. Eh. All right, we're broke, so we can't really do any of that stuff. How many deaths so far? I have a death counter in the bottom center. It's uh, either 26 or 27. Travis is saying 27. We'll bump it up, I guess. Hit the door. People in their messages, I'm telling you. What's going on here? First off, you don't have the right. <laughs> yeah, clearly I don't. 27's right? Okay. Thank you. This one's gonna say door also. 
Why is it always door? <laughs> That's a good question. <laughs> Uh, okay, hi. Greetings, great champion called by grace. I me. am Fia. Circumstances have compelled my stay at the round table hold. Great champion, would you allow me to hold you? But briefly, perhaps you might share with me some of your lifely vigor and your stout heartedness. I says Doing pardon. So will grant me the warmth of a champion, and you, I am sure, will bear a Balderkin's blessing. Do you think it vulgar, perhaps? Where I come from, it is a sacred act. Uh, <laughs> my wife's not on chat anymore, is she? I'm pretty sure she got tired of the game and left. All right, oh, you can hold me. My thanks, great champion. Do I need to put my sword and shield away, or? Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> She's about to lie with me. She just wants to hold me. It's a little awkward. I, do I do I cry now? Like like what? Very warm. Yeah. Baldigan's blessing. What does that even do? What you felt light up inside you was a Baldigan's blessing. Though it is but a fleeting thing, I am afraid. Come back to me, should you require another. I will take you in my arms as often as you need. <laughs> Again, so many jokes. How do I? Okay, well, thanks for that. I guess. How do I see? Oh, let me check my status. Maybe it'll show my my Baldekin's blessing here. Uh, I'm gonna go with nope. How do you have any idea what that did? I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> Maybe she's like secretly leeching my life force away or something. Seems like the kind of thing they do in a game like this. Tell you'd rather have two fingers next time. <laughs> Awkward. Is that all? Death. Why is it always a strong foe? Didn't expect strong foe, therefore suffering required ahead. Oh, look at all the blood down there. Yeah, we're not, not going down there. Yes, we are. What have I got to lose? I only have like a little bit of, uh, whoops. Oh. All right. Uh, we only have a little bit of rune anyway, so let's, uh, let's see what happens. Oh! Oh, invaded! Mad Tongue Albrick. So this is, uh... Oh, we gotta learn to gesture. Alright. Oh, me. Uh, I don't even know how to gesture in this game. That scythe hurts. Oh. <laughs> All right. Yep. That hurt. He's still killing my body. I'm already dead. <laughs> That's another death. <laughs> All 
No, they kicked me out. They're like, forget it. You don't belong here. Fine. Let's see if I care. That was cool. Okay, let's see if we can fight that, uh, whoops. That giant thing that was over here. It'll probably lead to more death, but as long as it's fun, what do we care? Yeah, that was an, an NPC invasion, so it's like PvP, but it's a, it's like a planned event. Instead of it being an actual player, it's just, uh, an NPC-controlled entity. You know what concerns me about this fight? Is all these rubbly things around here. Are they gonna get up and fight too? Because if so, I don't, I don't know if I want to. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Oh, it's one of these fights. We gotta hit him on the, uh, the weak spots, maybe. Oh, he's not even a boss. Oh, God, he hits hard, though. less dramatic than I thought it would be. Didn't expect weak foe, yeah. No, me neither. <laughs> That's funny. How long have I been playing so far? Um, I think when we finally got into the game, it was, what, maybe quarter after six or so? And then there's there's kind of a lot of, like, preamble leading up to the start of it, so... Let's say maybe 6.30 by the time we were sort of into the game. Uh, so it's been a little over three hours. What is this thing? Starlight shards. Time for cliff? Yeah, I think not. I don't know what this is about. Looks like it's showing, like, the phases of the moon or something. Flying jellyfish up there. He's aggressive. Gold tinged excrement. Excrement. Nice. That's what I wanted. Gold tinged pig poop. Fabulous. Think the jellyfish are uh, aggressive? Oh boy. Looks like they work together. The other one's turned aggressive too. Interesting. I guess they're not aggressive unless you attack them. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh boy. 
skeletons. They are hard to these skeletons stay down. <laughs> Oh, that would be negative. All right. Maybe we shouldn't be hanging out here. Ow! It's interesting the jellyfish seem to hang around the gravestones. Dr. Stractor watching now. What is the thing Fox is riding? This is like, uh, um, I, I don't know. <laughs> My mount, whatever it is. It's like some sort of like Orox or something. Gotta kill the skeletons again and give it for him. Yeah. Oh, why are these ones red? I'm hacking up a lung. Um, it looks like they killed that dude. And so now they're guarding the body. Uh, hey guys, what's, uh, what's going on? Oh god, there's more of them getting angry at me. <laughs> now they're all angry. Ooh, that sucked. Magic Grease. Oh, more skeletons. Good times. You guys are beefy looking. Fortunately, they're pretty weak. There's any way to actually kill them permanently. Need like a faith weapon or something. Blood Rose. Alright. Well, get out of here. Once the skellies are down, keep attacking. Do they? Will they die? I, I mean, in, in Dark Souls, I thought they just sort of kept going on forever. Oh, no, okay. You, I, I get it. You smash the skeleton and then they're toast. Alright. That's cool. Magic Reese, you need that for the Order of the Two Fingers? That's right. <laughs> so many jokes. Godric Soldier's Ash. Okay. That might be handy against that boss. He's an actual soldier. Oh, God! He's an actual soldier instead of, uh, instead of just wolves that are probably a little bit more squishy. Hey, friend. they're calling it today yep <laughs> there's sunlight in this game and trees there's no sunlight in trees and in dark souls you're right it's a it's a little less oppressive isn't it i mean there's there's actually a variety of weather i've seen like rain and wind and sun and night and yeah, there's actual foliage but it's not dark souls it's just the same you know the same genre of game from the same company Build that wolf on principle. 
Oh, missed. Missed again. up plants well there's a ton of plants so that's kind of the thing like you could spend all your time just running around grabbing plants i mean i don't know if there's like special plants you're talking about but <clears throat> all right of war. A straight sword special attack. Standard period. Hold on. Hold on. Each, each one of these weapons has like a an ability. I never really figured out how to use them yet. Wait. Uh, there we go. Oh, there we go. It said acquire materials. Yeah, but for what? Like, where did you where did you see it? Was it back at the graveyard area, or was it somewhere else? Yes, it's not marijuana. I swear. <laughs> I didn't nail. Oh, those pools just keep coming back, like every single time. So, like right here, acquire materials. You grab that, and you get like the row of fruit. Like any anything you find that you can pick up that's plant life. You just hit Y to acquire materials from it. Doesn't necessarily mean anything. No, I guess you can't check your map when you're on your horse. Oh, there we go. Uh, Roofside Cave. Let's go try it. Let's check out over here. I think it's down that way. Why do the trees look like they were having a good belly laugh? There was one where the uh, the undead things were walking out of it and they were doing that a bit. Mildly disturbing. This. Oh, these are all like stone swords. Godric the Golden, humiliated, having tasted defeat by the blade of Michaela, now on his knees begging for mercy. What to make of that? Ah, oh, he kicked me again. Actually, I guess he's kicking my my mount as opposed to me. But well, that sucked. Oh, I did not mean to get off my horse. Sucks to be you, buddy. Oh, I missed. Oh, God. Work on that mounted combat. A dismounter. Huh. Travis with a super chat. Are you gonna play Seven Days to Die anytime soon, or is it on the back burner? Whatever you decide, I'll still watch anyways. I enjoy the content. Well, thanks, super, uh, thanks for the super chat, Travis. Uh, I will be, but uh, probably for the next couple days, I'm gonna be playing a lot of this. Even it's uh, it's just come out, and I'm kind of obsessed with it right now. But yeah, we'll definitely be going back to play more. Can you get a bow? Uh, I'm pretty sure there are ranged weapons in the game, like bows, yep. I've gotten crossbow bolts, so I, I'm, gonna, I'm assuming there'll be bows also. Eat it, bird. 
Oh, there was nothing to loot from that one. <laughs> Surprise! That uh, guy on foot's pretty fast. He's keeping up. Ooh, that hurt. Oh my lord. I've hurt my horse thing. Whatever this thing's supposed to be. Yes. Oh, oh that hurt. <laughs> Get away from me. Another one coming in? Oh, it is. All right, let's get out of here. I'm not fighting 3D guys at once. Hey, Regina, thanks for clicking the join button. Welcome to the smart level. Appreciate the support. Thank you very much. Let's just go explore. Actually, let's cop off here. I'll reset my uh, uh, reset my flasks, and then uh, then we'll go explore. <whistles> they convinced me, Fox, that us uh, that uh, that, and I. Red, you can play as Sneak Archer, the best class. Yeah, there is uh, there is stealth in the game, which is surprising. Very non uh, non Dark Souls in that way. But the like the world environment looks great. We're only in the first area though. Like I don't, I don't I, oh god, I forgot about the fire. Uh, we're only in the first area though, so might be this. Why is he able to just hold out a torch and it stops me dead? That's that makes no sense. That is, a, that is one powerful torch, man. Andrew Gini with a super chat as well. Thanks, Andrew. Appreciate that. That's very generous of you. Oh, and fruit. Right. Love this horse. Well, steed. It's it's really not a horse. I don't I don't know what the heck it is. <laughs> the steed, though. Very steedy. Come on, I'm trying to kill the thing. How's it getting in my way? Ow. Missed. <laughs> there is definitely a timing thing to the heavy attack on horseback. Missed. Got him. Got him. Missed. Ah, uh, go up the wrong side. Okay, let's see if we can focus on this guy now. He jumped right over my swipe. Oh. You know what? Go toe to toe with this dude. Okay, maybe not. That hurt. <laughs> oh my god. Good lord. <laughs> I thought I was being all cool, jumping off my horse to fight him. That that sucked. Whew. Dagger. Whatever that little uh little dung beetle thing was that ran away. It's gone. I wanted to kill it, but it got away. Hmm. Thanks for saying my last name correctly. 
Oh. You're welcome. I guess I got lucky. Oh, God. You killed my horse! That was so rude! Just because I attacked you. Really. Let's attack his three. Ow. Oh, he staggered me. I didn't, didn't get a chance to counterattack. Bouldering butterflies. Those are good for those firebomb things that I made all one of and then ran out. Uh, so I can summon my steed back, but it's gonna, it's gonna cost me one of my flasks, I think. Oh, it didn't. Oh, that's weird. I thought it said that would be the case. Gallants. <clears throat> my name is Crypto Fox Toya. You killed my horse. Prepare to die. You killed my horse, animal thing, whatever it is. Prepare to die. Those guys are having a bad day. How do I get out of the back of this thing. I can't. Oh, there's no, uh, there's no chest on this one, though. Weird. What do you think? Are these guys just here for environmental detail, or do they actually fight? <laughs> Ow. He's like, are you kidding me? I'm stuck pulling this wagon? You're gonna pull this crap? This seems a little cheesy. <laughs> Oop, that hurt. Yeah, let's stop going for those double hits. If, uh, if this will like summon a boss or something, if I uh, if I kill these guys, if this one stopped now, he's like kneeled down. He's like, leave me alone. focused on the big guy, I guess. 
Uh, let's uh, turn up that death count there a little bit. <laughs> Got ambushed from behind. That's funny. He was mourning his brother. He just walked up and whacked him. Uh, yeah, well, it, wasn't, it wasn't even him that killed me. It was, well, he, and his stomp might have killed me, actually. But I got hit from behind by that, uh, that mounted guy, too. Oh, missed. A little too swervy. Nash, War of Determination. Ow. He was like, my gimp? Ooh, try to kick me, huh? Oh, oh, my horse thing. Oh, he killed me. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought he actually got just my horse. Oh, I lost my... I wasn't paying attention. I lost all that, uh, all the runes I had over there. <laughs> what was I thinking? I think I'm picking a fight with this guy. <laughs> Same thing I'm thinking now, I guess. Oh no! <laughs> I almost jumped over the side. <laughs> uh, give me my horse. Oh god! Is that miss? And I can see with a little bit of practice and getting the hang of the, uh, the horseback combat, it could be really helpful. Need a ranged weapon? That would be nice. Down there was where the dragon stomped me. Well, roughly down there anyway. I don't know exactly where. Oh! I hurt. <laughs> There's those giants again. Maybe we'll leave them alone. Oops. Maybe we'll leave them alone this time. <laughs> Pretty wish you had the finger gun now. Oh yeah. Good old finger gun power. Especially in a game that seems to be so focused on fingers. I oh, missed. I just want to hug and pet you and call him George. Oh, there's a ghost up here. Oh, sapling, sweet slap, sapling of glorious gold. Has your crystal teardrop ripened? Okay. That's random. I don't know what the deal is with all the ghosts.
to be determined, I guess. This this game doesn't really give you a lot of information. Like these ghosts, like this guy here, that's another player. Oh god. Uh, but like that one kneeling on the cliff there, that's uh, that's definitely not. That's something else. Given given some degree of information. <laughs> What's this guy doing? Seek Elden Ring. Yeah. Dead. Gold pickled foul foot. <laughs> what on earth is that about? Uh, boost rune acquisition for a time. Oh, okay. Good for farming. Jump kick him. Oh, if only I could. If only I could. I mean, we can probably ride up and jump off the horse and hit stuff, but... Not really a jump kick. What is that giant thing? That'll be a little mini boss right there. What are the odds you're gonna kill me? Yeah. Allergies. What's that gonna go on for? I was not expecting that. Give me the remains. Oh, poison. What did I loot there? Coats aren't limited. Oh. That was uh, that magic Reese we got is a thing we can put on our weapons. Immunize cure meat, temporarily boosts immunity. Very unfriendly. If I do say so myself. Oh my god! Don't attack that thing from the front. Well, there's another death. Oh, I missed uh I missed adding up some deaths, didn't I? <laughs> I'm gonna spam, I got it. Oh. But my body should be like right here somewhere. There it is. Found it. There's a stairway going down there. I want to go check. <clears throat> At 31. Yeah, I got it updated. Man, I want that spell. The old sound. What that means. Killing all your babies. Didn't expect weak foe. 
Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, this looks like the Onion Knight. Got a big flail or something. Oh, that was a mess. <laughs> I do not want to bleed out on this thing. Ow. Ow. Nothing's owning me. Wait, I was looking at the wrong health meter. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, we got two thirds of his life. <laughs> that guy's not very nice to me. He hit me with a big thing that hurt it a lot. Point ruins. Reverse the mist. Ow. Ow. <laughs> we not hit me for a second here. I'm trying to collect my stuff. Pumpkinhead's the guy's name, no less. Aw, oh, did not time that right. <laughs> I tried to parry him. <laughs> oh. oh, that went so much worse. You have to hit him? Is that how that works? Oh my god. Doing it all wrong. <laughs> this guy might take a little bit of practice. That flail does quite a bit of damage. Good times the charm, yeah. I guess we'll see. It'll help if I hit him a bit more, probably. Ideally without getting hit myself a lot. Even though I blocked it. Seems like his uh the arm side is the better side to rotate to. 
The hits aren't quite as consistent there. Oh, then again. Oh my god, I can't get... I get a pattern down here. Every time I hit him, he comes back with an immediate swing. <laughs> I'm guessing hitting his helmet's not gonna do a lot. Our new pumpkin head. Sight of me. Oh, nope, timing that all wrong. Oh, I almost had him. <laughs> hey, I think I, we'll get him this next time. I think I got them all figured out. That's right, I'm gonna tire him out by repeatedly taking his blows. If he can hit me with that thing often enough, his arm will get so tired he won't be able to swing anymore. And then he'll want to negotiate. At which point we'll accept his surrender. Magnanimously, of course. Oh, sorry, death counter. 34 times, oh my god, did I miss that many? <laughs> I might need to do it again. I'm not... It's a bit of a delay between when I hit it and when I see it on stream. Ow. Heavy swing's not worth it. Oh god! Come on, buddy, can't we be friends? Because I came into your home with a sword means nothing. He's actually not got that many hit points. Oh, timed it wrong again. Oh, that sucks. A block with your head. Heal, please. Heal, please. Stop with the head. Shouldn't have gone for the heavy swing there. No, don't die! No, no, no! Oh, why? <laughs> why? I had him. I screwed it up at the end. Oh, that was dumb. All right, what do we have to now? <laughs> oh, that should have been easy. I had to spit on him, pretty much. Too bad there's no left finger of Glover, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag flawless, absolutely. That was, that was a flawless attempt right there. The mistake was that I, uh, I did a heavy attack there toward the end and I shouldn't have. I thought I was, I was trying to finish him quickly and I should have known better. It's Dark Souls. Oh, that sucked. That sucked again. Mm 
That sucked. No, don't do it again. No, no. <laughs> I swear to God, this game. Can you break the helmet? I don't know. When you hit it, it only does like 15 damage or something. Versus when you actually hit his body and it does like 75. So, I don't know if it's worth it to try to break the helmet. You just got avoid it, I guess, but... I'm sure I had it that time, and then I blew it. What a mess. Definitely spoke too soon, yeah. <laughs> oh, my souls. Runes, whatever they are. Oh, come on, not, not this again. Ooh, that hurt. Oh, back off. Oh, I'm stuck here. I cannot get the timing of that. Again, same thing. Finally. Good grief. Oh, that should not have been that hard. Got here. Sparkly's floating around. Lost Grace discovered. You lost Gracie? No, it's okay. We discovered her. It's fine. She's not really lost anymore. Travis with another super chat. Yay! You finally got one. Thanks, Travis. Appreciate the super chat. You've sent a ton of those tonight, man. That's exceedingly generous. Maybe a little too much. Appreciate the support, though. Um. What's up with this? Sorcery ahead. Hey, dude. You, uh, what you doing here? Tarnished, are we? I wonder you should turn up here. I am Salen, a sorcerer, quite plainly. Why are you here? Quite plainly. You're a woman with a statue's thing on your head. I want to learn sorcery. Ah, a yen for glinstone sorceries. I dare say your proclivities are far from ideal. Oh, well, perhaps nurture will defy nature. With a bit of luck. But one must choose one's masters wisely. I was exiled from the Academy of Rea Lucaria. 
as a reviled apostate witch. Do you still wish to learn from me? I have no idea what Rhea Lucari is, so absolutely. <laughs> well, you are a piece of work. Very well. You are now my protege in Glinstone sorcery. But I refuse to coddle or cast kind words. Never. Anticipate grievances, young apprentice. Is this where she calls me stupid because I don't have high intelligence in this game? Glintstone Pebble. Glintstone Stars. Our three shooting stars are Pursue Foes. Uh, Glintstone Arc fires a horizontal widening magic arc. The Barrage fires a volley of Glintstone Crystal Shards. Scholar's Armament. Chance right-handed armament uh, with magic damage. Then Scholar Shield enhances left uh, hand shield damage negation. That's cool. I mean, we're not going to be doing sorcery with this particular character, but kind of neat. <laughs> and I learned another gesture. I can nod in thought, and I can smash all of her stuff, since I don't need to be her apprentice. Thanks, lady. See you later. <laughs> Eat her at all. That's cool. Killed the mini-boss, though. Still want to know what the deal is with this, uh, stinky plant up here. Ow! Oh, God! Oh, God! <laughs> Alright, that, that might have been ill-advised. She went, wow, you're smooth-brained. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Check my inventory for a new helmet. Okay. Ooh, that's a cool looking picture. Uh, new helmet, you say? Oh, I just have these things. Foot soldier caps. Nothing good. Let there be message. Pool is now functioning. Is the helmet function as a dunce cap? It probably should have. I'm gonna wear it. Poison Bloom. This mess. I wonder if the Poison Bloom will be for, uh, oh! Be for, uh, upgrading a weapon. Got like a Poison Blade or something. Yeah, that stinky stuff. Actually, if I could get it to cast that magic over here that shoots the the beams of light down, then I might be able to. Uh, there we go. Might be able to run it and hit it while it's doing that. With minimal risk. Try to squish me. Not a flower. Back up. Well, I'm broken. <laughs> this will work. If I can get it to shoot at me over here, then I can run in and get it. Oh, don't do that. It's stingy. Dark Souls! This is Elden Ring, so it's actually created by From Software, the same people that made Dark Souls. Uh, it It is very much at its core a Dark Souls game, even though it doesn't bear the title. Uh, but it's open world. It's got some mechanics in it that are very different from uh, some of the Dark Souls games and stuff. Super fun. I didn't mean to do that. Taking a while, but I guess patience will win out, hopefully.
Come on, flower thing. No, don't do that. Uh. Red. Don't worry, it's not poison, it's just pollen. Hey, listen, when you've got allergies, it's basically the same thing. It's toxic. The pumpkin helm was supposed to drop. It might be one of those things where there's just a chance of getting it. Oh god, oh god. I'm that wrong. Should have waited. Unless maybe when I when I was in there, I just failed to get the uh, the pumpkin helmet. I suppose that's possible. Maybe it's sitting on the ground there somewhere. I'll go take a look. Anyone anyway, remember the old movie, the giant talking flower that eats people? Uh, um, isn't that Little Shop of Horrors or whatever? Almost dead. Take a Benadryl and attack it as you pass out. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Better give me something good. Poison Bloom and Miranda Powder. I did it! Yeah, me too. After several failed attempts. What's in here? Okay, I'll see if the pumpkin head's down here, but it, like I said, it might just be one of those, like, uh, random chance drops. Dino helmet. Nothing shiny. Shot around it will do the job. <laughs> it would have been a lot quicker than trying to kill it with a sword, probably. Okay, we're over here now. We're right on the edge of another area where we just haven't uncovered the map yet. Um, if I followed the road down this way, I would probably find another signpost that shows more, but there's all those mounted guys over there that are kind of a pain. Oh, big miss. That would have been a good, perfect chance for a good first strike. Oh, call for help. Went super well. Fabulous. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I missed a couple deaths there. <laughs> we gotta be at least 37, right? That hurt a little bit. Oh, the cart guys are back. Oh, the flower is too. Oh, God! Probably could Pay a little bit of attention, maybe. Damn, they got a whole army around behind the cart. They didn't have all those guys the first time. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, 
Oh, my soul's back, you jerks. Or my runes or whatever. Oh no! Come on, don't die again. There. Essie. That was sloppy. These guys hit hard, man. Uh, you're 38, you have your own CC. What's CC? Some sort of company? Hey, what do we got going on here? <laughs> Ramped area. Yeah, thanks. Oh, they were just ruin fragments. I thought it was actually fighting for something worth picking up. Oh, CC credit card. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I'm super smart. Oh, someone in chat thought you took your took your mom's card. <laughs> you shouldn't have done that, man. Your mom's gonna miss it. encampment up here. Oh, big miss. Glintstone staff. Oh, nice. One of those I've seen. Come on, friend. Oh, there's a glintstone mage up there. Oh, God! <laughs> They're homing missiles. Oh, big miss. Oh no! Oh, my face. He hurt me in my face. That was a big whiffer. I don't want to kill that guy up there with the. Oh god. Kill that guy up there with the magic, man. Glintstone staff! <laughs> yeah, you can summon a dino now, that's right. Now, Betty! <laughs> Got 
Okay, so it does hit objects. That's a plus. These guys with these big swords, man. I'm telling you, they're trouble. I need to sneak in on that guy when he's uh, not paying attention. On a chest. Uh, great epee. All right. Got a new weapon. Guys, no, no. Oh god, I'm stuck. Great, he just called for help. Okay, that that could have been handled better. Oh god. Oh no! <laughs> Not of a gun. 1961 runes hiding up there now. I like how the horse got double jump? Yeah, it's neat. It helps for like uh like mobility getting around the map and stuff, it's great. Oh. Right? Resurrected at the crazy lady statue. Oh, that hurt. Don't kill me. I need my need my runes back. Uh, should have gone for the fast attack. Oh jeez. Cheating. Gotta get it. Let's, let's go somewhere with it. Oh my god, I couldn't target him. Well, there goes 1,900 runes. <laughs> yeah. No more runes. Brutal. Ooh, that guy's a, that's why he had a staff. Especially one of those mages. Thorts were dude. Ow. Messy. Oh, forgot to increase my death count, didn't I? So much for that. That sucks. How did he not see me? Oh no! <laughs> okay, he did kinda... Better heal. Oh god, I'm so dead. Dead. Travis with a super chat, I'm using my mom's card. Shh, don't tell anyone, JK, JK. Legit's mine, you deserve it. Keep going. Uh, content in your desk are awesome. Keep it up, beating your death counter. <laughs> 
<laughs> Thanks, Travis. There goes the death counter again. Man, I'm doing a really good job of dying. What are we? We're at 39 already. Might even get to 50 before we're done. This is sweet. <laughs> we got all the dying's mastered. Here, we killed him. You watch the Dark Souls Logic series on Viva La Dirt's League channel? Too funny and accurate. Uh, I don't think I have actually seen it, no. Oh no! Oh, why do I always do that? The frequency with which I accidentally click in the, the, uh, the right stick and then dismount is just disturbing. Oh, I got the other guy's attention, too. I'm gonna cut his horse on him. <laughs> the one guy's almost dead. Now he's dead. Oh, big miss. Jerk. That's my horse. Or whatever it is. My trusty steed. And we mess with a guy's trusty steed, you know? Uh oh. Got the wall still stopped it. I wasn't sure if it was going to. Need that guy with the horn. It's like Souls games, you can't get hurt when you're in the middle of a backstab, so that's a plus. A little late to kill him, I guess. Ow, stop hitting me! Alright, come fight me over here. Oh, oh no, no, I lied, I lied, I lied! <laughs> I had to do something about those magic casters up there. Oh, it's a cliff. Oh, good. Oh, this is well. This is well planned. Planned this one out super good. been streaming uh i went live around uh quarter to six tonight so uh, like eh, a little over five hours yeah the game wasn't available right away unfortunately we had to wait it released in uh eastern time zone at uh at six eastern slightly delayed but six eastern nevertheless uh okay let's uh Oh, 
about no kill him there we go one down oh god you heal again Almost got it. There's like one guy left. <laughs> Should be higher with the death counter. Come on, fifty. Oh yeah, we'll get we'll get there. Don't you worry. Can I get up to this one? Look like I can. Oh boy, that was close. Come on. Careful, horse. Goat. Oxen. Whatever you are. There we go. I got bad news for you, friend. Of course I knocked it off. Why wouldn't I? Uh, I thought once you cleared out an encampment, you got something as a reward, but not seeing a reward here. Oh, they're not done yet. There we go. Now it's clear. I got my SS flask back. Not this is whatever they are. Is that it? Oh wait, there was the uh, another one of those uh, weird like moon tracking bowls over here. Whatever it is. Your reward is the satisfaction of a job well done. Starlight shards again. No idea what those are for, but... Yeah, this map is cool. If the rumor's true, Icarus is getting 60 total talent points, separating solo points from talent points and more solo talents. Oh, nice. Yeah, the uh, I was a little disappointed with the, some of the the solo ones because when uh, when I paired up with Nate, they were just completely useless. It'd be nice if uh, there's like a different pool of points there. This work the whole like little pathway down here. Oh, there's one of those windy spots that the horse can jump on. I wonder if you can jump down to it as well as up. I don't necessarily want to experiment and find out because just killed everything over here. More purple hearts. Even like that twitch purple. What the heck was that? What? The? No! 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 <laughs> No! No! What the? No! <laughs> I can't. I can't. Get my shield out! Oh my god! Holy crap! 
Real question is, can you pet the bears in the game? I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess no. Uh, just judging by his uh, mildly aggressive attitude. Man, I did poke the bear. Holy cow. That was ridiculous. Who knew killing some random little dude was so dangerous? I don't know how far those guys will chase me. Oh, there's a world boss thing down there. Look at the giant crab. Or mini boss, whatever it is. Give me magmice runes, man. I want to fight that bear guy, but I... I'm scared. I just like casually like cut him apart and I was like, oh, this is easy, the little guy standing here, we'll just, we'll just trim him off. Boom, bear. That was ridiculous. Ridiculous. Oh, and get my worst thing. Oh man. I bet you guys don't blow that horn. That'd be great. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not what I meant to do. Oh my god, I'm so dead. Super giant big bear chase me. Oh man, it was bear ridiculous. That's what it was, and that was that was really lame too. I shouldn't have died there. That was dumb. What does the horn do? It calls in reinforcements. So um, if there's if there's other enemies that are within hearing distance, they'll uh, they'll come along too and join the fight. Kind of rude, really. Excuse me, come through. Don't chase me. As <laughs> they blow the horn. D E D dead. Oh yeah, I forgot to up update the dead counter. Reinforcements coming. Didn't work for you that time, did it? Okay, let's go try our luck at the bear again. I wonder if the if it's the bear every time, or if that was just like a random occurrence kind of thing. Let's go with the super chat. Ursine wouldn't let you get your bearings. Ha! ha yep. <laughs> Very punny. Buddy. Oh my god, I'm doing very little damage. Oh, that hurt. Oh, no! <laughs> no. <laughs> Are you kidding 
kidding? Oh, off the cliff? Nope, nope. Oh God, stuck, stuck. Heal me. Any rough friends. I'm out of here. No, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm gonna try and get far enough away I can mount up. I'm not fighting that guy. I'm doing like almost no damage to him. That's ridiculous. And that bear hug was something else. Man. The worst part is he had that like sweaty bear chest hair thing going on. Got it all smushed up the side of my face. My cheek was all wet. Just nasty. Nasty. Someone needs to teach that guy the magic of deodorant. <laughs> Out of here, guys. See ya. Every time I join on, Fox dies. Well, what can I say? It's uh, it's Dark Souls style game. I mean. Death pretty much describes most of this. Oh, look at that. There's, e there's even a hidden grace right here. Could have known what's something to fight right there. Uh, where's my... Well, let's, uh, I'll activate this thing and then look at my souls, I guess. My, uh, runes. This is, wow, it's a urinary that's ten levels higher than you. Potentially, I mean, the enemies here aren't... Most of them aren't bad. It's the the mounted guys with those big swords are pretty, pretty strong. That bear was ridiculous. Cool, but also ridiculous. And there's all those things up there I gotta worry about too. Plus we got this uh, crab thing down here. I remember a little bit of a little crab rangoon. I wonder how tough he is. <laughs> Probably very. Wow, it was uh, World of Warcraft. Oh, that hurt. Oh my god, I'm not. This is not working. Go your baby. Missed. Just again. I wonder if I can like uh, strafe by him or something from behind here. Nope, that didn't work. He's fast. Okay. Stop hurting my horse. <laughs> Missing all the babies. Oh, there's a body there. Hey, Krabby. Oh, oh, boy. Hey, buddy. You win. Killing all the babies. Don't worry. Oh, I missed. Darn it. Oh, these stupid bugs, too. Oh, leave me bait. I'm gonna try and fight this thing, but I wanna get rid of these little crab things here in case they join in. Ah. Yeah. 
Ah! I hit that one turtle. Or one crab, rather. Alright. Let's see if he kills me, like, right away. That hurt. Oh, he's spitting on me now. That's just rude. Which Dark Souls was it that had that swamp area with these giant crab things in it? This is pretty much the same thing. It's like the same attacks and everything, too. It's a slightly different, uh... Probably a different texture to the, uh, the look of it. Crab eggs. Was it Dark Souls 3? <laughs> I can't even hit it. I'm, I'm on my own two feet now. That's skill. More crab eggs. Oh, there's none of those things. And another crab. Okay, I thought- Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> it's an ambush! Go for it! Cheese it! Go, 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 go! Oh my god! <laughs> Ambushed. I think jerk. What bugs? Back here. Not a fan of these bugs. I <laughs> need like a spell or something I can hit him with. Did I kill it? No, I didn't. There we go. Good lord. This thing like, suck. Why is this thing so hurt already? I didn't even do anything. I wonder if they can hurt each other. There we go. In Elder Ring, Crab gets you! And all these crab eggs. Run your bed. Great dragonfly head. What do I do with that? Gotta be like a crafting item or something. No? Huh. What are the great dragonfly heads for? Oh wait, maybe that's- is that a weapon? Nope. I don't know. Not a talisman. Weird. Come on, bub. Ugly man. Ow. Especially when they do that. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. The other bug's gonna kill me. more crabs. Funny, when I saw that guy standing out there in the water, I thought it would be, uh... It'd be like a mini-boss. Oh, missed. You missed too, though, jerk. Here you. He's flying around me now. I can't even catch him.
<laughs> That's so annoying. Like dragonflies in real life. Oh, you jerk! Got him. The great dragonfly ad. Okay. I mean, it's satisfying. We need drawn butter. <laughs> we defeated them with their ultimate enemy, drawn butter. Where does a hat? Oh, maybe. Uh, how many points have I got here? I didn't even see. Ruins held thirty-three forty. Maybe I should boost up my vigor to try to get my uh, my hit points up a bit. Hey, Cat Dean, how you doing? Gotta go. Uh, Fun Fox was uh, hoping since you were playing, it would get some idea of uh, if it was worth playing. Thanks, Jay. I don't know if you've left already or not, but uh, thanks for dropping in. If you like Dark Souls style games, then I, you know, I think you'll probably like this one. It's pretty darn good. Uh, bounce up again. Okay, so there's another, another rune up, another uh, hidden grace up here somewhere. Pointing me up the hill towards these evil things. What are they gonna do to me? Can't help but wonder. Look, like they're passive. Now they're passive, right? Oh, what's this? Forlorn how ever jail. With the really weird way of spelling jail. Enter the ever. Oh, this must be one of the first uh, one of the first dungeon areas. Forlorn how ever jail. Yeah. All right. How much freedom do they give you in designing your character? Gender, height, face? There's, uh, there's all kinds of adjustables for that. Um, so yeah, you choose your gender, you've got your, uh... Um... You know, all your settings and stuff to adjust all the face, facial features and body and that kind of stuff. I didn't really spend a lot of time on it. Because realistically, by the time you put all the equipment on... You're not seeing most of what you designed anyway. So I didn't really spend a ton of time on it. But, uh, but you could if you wanted to. So, the path from that last, uh, that last Grace thing pointed me up to here, but no Grace up here. Unless it's just saying I can go to the dungeon. Yeah, uh, it's a really old way of spelling jail. We had, uh, the town I lived in out west, they had a, a jail in town that still had that written on the front of it. Little old timey, like small town jail kind of thing. Spirit Spring jumping! Jumping while on horseback near a Spirit Spring to ride its current high into the air. You won't take damage from jumping into a Spirit Spring while on horseback, even from a great height. Uh, A to spirit spring to spirit jump. That's cool. That answers that question. I wondered whether we could jump down into it or whether it was just an upward motion thing, but... Ooh, Lord Sworn Straight Sword. How's that compare to what I have? It's got a higher crit. Forget what the letters are for the scale. Oh god. Nice of him just to sit there and look at me. Come here, you. Oh, God!
great dragonfly head. So that sword was slightly lower damage than the one I'm using, but uh, it's also it's also not upgraded. The one I'm using right now I upgraded like twice, um, so they might actually be fairly comparable. Except that the, that other one has a slightly higher slightly higher crit to it. Oh, there's that skull I knocked off, maybe. I killed a kangaroo squirrel thing, and I didn't even get anything out of it. Look at the map. Crazy. <laughs> yes, Ashley, here she gonna die about a coma, <laughs> like from all the uh, the deaths we've had. You mean? <laughs> It's like, it's too sweet, can't take it anymore. Oh, they got one of those fire launching things again. Listen, we can talk about this, right guys? Right? kind of thing where if you sneak in here at nighttime it's easier because the uh I can't see you as well or something. Oh, oh stamina bad. Jump, buddy. He's got wings. This. And the stones word key. Old sword key, rather. This guy had a bad day. <laughs> oh, there we go. Weeping Peninsula. I've still only found one of the map markers so far that actually lets you add on to your map. Oh my god. So much to see. Uh, I'm probably getting into an area I shouldn't be in, I would guess. No matter if I, I can just teleport my way back, I guess. We didn't check over here, did we? I ended up taking the road up to the castle instead of taking the road down this way. Let's take, uh, I'm gonna go over to here. We'll port all the way back. Uh, not that the areas are prohibited, but they're just prohibitively difficult. So they don't, they don't stop you from going places. But you could be trying to go somewhere that's, uh, that you're not ready for, basically. Is that even a roadway? I thought this was a road along here. Well, I guess it kind of is. It's a bit like one anyway. Like an animal path or something. So much to do, so much to see, yeah. I mean, and, and there's no guidance in terms of where you're going. You get a little bit from the, the Hidden Grace things. They, they give you a sense of what you should be looking at, but... Um, it's only like, uh, oops. 
only it's only like a general direction of where you should be going. It doesn't necessarily necessarily tell you what to do, and like it, it would in a lot of games. You guys hit hard, man. Fire arrows. Still got that beacon that I left. I should probably pick that up. Killed Bambi. And his twin. None of those wolf ambushes. Lump of flesh. Mmm. Tasty. This weird growling noise. Look, they got traps here. Any survival mechanics like hunger or cooking? No, no, it's uh, although it's open world, it's not um, not really a survival game. It's uh, more of like a combat adventure RPG kind of game. I meant to backstab him. Oh, the heck is that thing? They have the world's ugliest dog, man. You all right? Do we need to call some help for you? That looks nasty. Isn't that a bath in about a century? hit by that guy. Oh, no. That guy's got a big shield. And he lost interest. <laughs> These little camps scattered everywhere are kind of neat. Gonna see me and get upset at me. Oh god, oh god, oh god, that was bad. Why'd I do it? Why? Why? Oh my god! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, oh, oh boy, oh boy, we're out of here. Come on, doggo. He's fast. Ow. <laughs> it triggered the alarm. 
Oh no! Ooh, Gilded Great Shield. Daughter Knight Armor. Wait, what kind of armor am I wearing right now? Ooh. Yes, please. Armor upgrade. <laughs> the shield's too heavy, though. We can't use that. <laughs> oh, look at that cloak now. That's pretty sweet. I'm liking that. Yeah, it is a little on the heavy side, isn't it? So it's 11.8 versus 10.6, so it's another another 1.2. But I'm still in the medium weight range, so and it adds another three poise too, which is kind of nice. Still no item. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Exalted Flesh. Miss me. This chest. Beast Crest Heater Shield. Okay. How's that shield compare? Not as good protection against holy, but it has higher magic and fire. Not by a lot, but a little bit. Same weight. I'm not really dealing with holy right now anyway. Let's use that shield. Plus it looks cooler. But the same weight, no less. I was sneaking up on you when you turned and saw you sneaking wasn't possibly reacted and sped up. Yeah, it was neat. Man, there's nothing about this game I don't like yet. This is great. Aside for the fact that my controller was misbehaving earlier, but that was mostly because of like tapping out for OBS. Somebody's sneaking up on me. Hey, buddy. Oh, that was the last thing to kill in the camp, too. All right. Supposed to be at 50 deaths now. You mean like real, like I'm, like I've died 50 times, or I'm supposed to have gotten there? <laughs> I think it'd be true, really. Hello. Oh. Can you hear me? Hi. Me. I'm stuck. Hello. <laughs> it's the pot Hello? boy. Hey, dude. Oh, my stars. 
I'm so happy to see you. I am I'm loving it so far. Also known as the Iron Fist. And as you can see, I'm stuck here. Please, can you help me out of this? My thanks. A thousand thanks. Just give me a good smack from the rear with something nice and big. And I'll pop clean out, I'm sure. Uh, I don't think I have no, anything nice and big to, to hit him with. I'm very well Give it your all, I say. Oh, God! Freaking bugs! There's just something wrong with fighting dragonflies with a sword. Ace. Oh, village corpse. Look at these great dragonfly heads. I don't even know what they're for. Try up, butthole. <laughs> Come on. Give me a good smack from behind with something nice and big. I'll pop clean out. I'm sure of it. Yeah, we need to. I don't think this is going to be big enough. Oh, there we go. Hey, it did work. Triumphant delight. Ah, well played, good sir. Well played. Though that mighty wallop of yours almost spelt the end of me. <laughs> hey, his dialogue is really quiet. Ah, well, I'm out now, and that's what counts. I thank you. And as a token of my appreciation, I'd like you to have this. Does it sound good? Exalted flesh. Oh, uh, well, thanks. Again, the pleasure is mine. I journey to the east, where I intend to further my education in the ways of war. And beyond these lands lie the scarlet, rot blighted, calid wilds. And upon their southern edge is Redmain Castle, in which a festival of combat is being held. I'd heard whispers of such festivities before. Doesn't the notion set your breast a flutter? <laughs> I'm heading eastward. It does something to anyway. Red Main Castle, on the southern edge of the scarlet, rot blighted king. I've heard there's to be a. All right. Cool. Well, he's free. We don't have to do anything else with him. Oh, there's that. Uh... Wait, that, that's gotta be. A different pond. Okay, so that critter that's in the water, the evil spaghetti thing, is uh, clearly not unique. Seeing as how there's another one right there. Nice, another grace. Oh look, there's a pumpkin head dude over there. Bot head dude was stuck in the hole for some time. That exalted flesh isn't fresh. Yeah, it's a little bit uh, maybe past its prime, but I'm sure it's fine. Maybe. Hopefully. Hopefully. I got my hands on some more, uh, some more of those fate spell things. We can fight this guy. So, I guess this guy's not as tough as the other pumpkin head guy because he doesn't have a big on health bar. Ow. Don't knock me over. Sanctuary stone. That. Ah. Is a sanctuary stone. Maybe it's for upgrading things. Yeah, his pumpkin butt. We smoked him. 
Yeah, it wasn't nearly as tough as the one who was down in the uh, little hidey hole. Limgrave. Welcome to Limgrave. Cool. Look, you can actually get down there. That's cool. Clearly no one's taking that bridge across, though. No. Oh. Another vendor guy here. Oh, dear. You might... I... Terribly sorry. Uh, are you here as a customer? Still, Starlight Shards used to gradually recover FP. No thanks. Uh, if I have like any extra weapons I don't need. Look at all these slivers of meat and stuff. All this stuff for crafting. Oh, that's what the, uh, the Dragonfly heads are for. They're for crafting. Smithing stones. I have a lot of smithing stones. We could be upgrading some more gear. Ash of War, unsheathed, usable on Katana. Oh, that would be really cool as an ability. Ash of War, Determination. Short Sword, don't like that. Note, Flame Chariots. Pickled Turtleneck. Temporarily boost Stamina Recovery. Oh, crack pot. Yeah, it's by that. You need that for crafting. Oh, I must apologize. I, 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 I'm afraid of very little to offer. Well, I got a crack pot off him at least. Uh, go here. Let's do item crafting. Not a lot I can craft just yet. Make fire pots. Bone darts, throw enemies to inflict damage. I wonder if you level up in this game at all by, uh, like your crafting ability by making things. Any benefit to it, I wonder. <laughs> That's crack pipe? <laughs> yeah, not crack pipe, crack pot. <laughs> I guess some of the things that we craft require a pot to put them in when you're crafting it. But... Stay down. I'll look around here for any collectibles on the way through. We're gonna find another map post. Oh boy. This guy's a little specialer. Ow! Yeah, it's like a reaper or something. Didn't expect cleric. There's no mistake. Is the death has left its mark oh. once Buddy? again. Ah, a tarnished are you? I'm known as D. 
I hunt down those who live in death and weed their death root. Heed my warning. The village here has been touched by death. And worse yet, it is home to a mariner. If you value your life, then go no further. What's a mariner? And what's with your armor, dude? The village here has been touched by turn back. Huh. And we shouldn't be going this way yet. I wonder if their message changes based on like uh on what your level is. I don't want to stay on the road so I can try and find another map post. Oh no, not a sailor! <laughs> yeah. I don't know what the deal is with the mariner, but it says it like it's kind of important. There's a little boat over there. Maybe that's the mariner. Let me know how to summon the fourth player in co-op. Uh, I have no idea. I haven't tried co-op at all yet. Summon water village. Oh, hey guys. Uh, you all undead and stuff? Oh, I should have focused on that guy first. Leading me out with his scythe. God. I wonder if we clear the village out if the uh, priest back there will give us anything special. <laughs> First off, head. <laughs> He's missing a head. There's the boatman. Which I'm assuming is the mariner. That's me, bugs. Oh, it is a very bright. It's almost midnight my time. I'm gonna be calling it a wrap soon for tonight. And then uh, streaming tomorrow night as well. I mean, tomorrow during the day. Oh, no, oh, now I got his attention. That oh, 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 he's got friends. Uh, I didn't mean to bother you, sir. Oh, it's a, a boss. Where'd it go? And some sort of a boss fight, but it's gone. and vanish like a fart in the wind. Oh, 
Oh, I can ride right here to the boat. Come on, kill it. fight. Go, Mariner. Oh my god. Can't hit him. Ow. No, no, I'm all of, uh, all of healing. Records with himself. This is a really weird fight. Interesting, but I wonder if it's gonna be like a multi-phase thing where we gotta fight the guy this way and then he's gonna like be more problematic in a minute.
Oh boy. Oh god, I didn't mean to get off my horse. <laughs> Strange fight, but we win. <laughs> Dude, death root. What is that? Got little militiaman ashes. Huh. Some of those ashes might be fun to play around with that one boss I was having a really hard time with. I'll have to go back and try and tackle that next time we play. Like tomorrow morning. There's smithing stone. I wonder if the cleric will have a reward for us for doing anything. <laughs> Come here, whippersnapper, when he hit with my boat. That was a really weird fight. It wasn't really all that dangerous. Was the music super loud? Sorry. Didn't seem as loud to me when I was listening, but... Oh, he's gone. Well, so much for that guy. I'm gonna teleport back to the, uh... The chamber with the, uh, the circular table or whatever. Like the round table set up. Papa, flask, memorized spell. About this, uh, I thought we could teleport from here. Maybe I gotta, like. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Just did the same thing. Hooray! Last time, a little up flask, sort chests. He goes to the village? Oh, okay, great. Clark shows up at the spot in the, where the Mariner was. Okay. Uh, in that case, let's let's go back there. See if we can find him. How many souls did I get from the trash mobs? Not a lot, I don't think. I think each one of them was maybe 50. Something like that. I've, only, I've still only got 4,600 of the, uh, the runes on me. Where did he go exactly? Yeah, I keep calling them souls too. I can't help it. <laughs> oh, these things respawn because I, uh, I used the uh, grace thing there. Where is he? Oh!
Oh, wait a minute. I can use a, uh, I can use one of the keys on this thing. What do you got? Oh, it just opens up the dungeon area. Yeah, the bottom right shows the uh, the runes that I've got. 4600 and change. Okay, so we just unlocked this uh this little dungeon thing. That's cool. Probably another like mini boss fight. Unless it's where the cleric went. I saw the cleric under a tree in the pond. But it was day. So he was actually in the water? Yeah, maybe he'll come back in the daytime. I don't see him here. Not that that necessarily means that much. Oh, the reflection of the water. Oh, if he's gonna come back here, he's uh, definitely not here now. But let's see what's in this uh, this thing we opened up down here. Opens up a door to my death. Yeah, pretty much. All right, I got to spend a key for the privilege of dying. That's amazing. Hooray! Turtles. We got a fight in here, Super Mario. Dog. Be crab. Ah, uh, friendship. Okay, turtles. I don't know if I should kill you all preemptively or not, but you don't look aggressive. Chest. Praise the dog. What we got? <laughs> Green turtle talisman. What's that do for me? Raises stamina recovery speed. You know what? I'm gonna use that. That's handy. Cool. Daytime now. Whereabouts was the priest when you saw him? Step on the edge of a turtle and watch it ricochet around. <laughs> yeah. Hope I'm enjoying the game. Yeah, it's great so far. I'm having a lot of fun with it. I was so looking forward to this game, and, it, and you know how it is with, with stuff when you're really anticipating it. It's really easy to be disappointed because you build up expectations about what it's going to be. So far, it's uh, it's lots of fun. The map's great. We're only in such a small, small area of it that we've been able to get exposed to so far. Right, I'll come back here maybe during the daytime and check. It's, uh... Not working right now. Alright, I'm gonna go see what's going on back here. I wonder if the people that I found are gonna show up back there. Oh yeah, here he is. Ah, we meet again. I'm glad you took my warning to heart. Those who live in death should be left well alone. All the more should you spy a mariner among their number. Show death route. Well, well <laughs> another fool who won't listen to reason, eh? But with a prowess for weed in death root. Hmm. How would you like to earn the strength of beasts? 
If you're inclined to hunt more of those who live in death and weed their death route, then I'll introduce you to Garank, the beast clergyman. Oh. I have a matter of my own to attend to. And hey, Brian, how's it going? Self wishes for someone to take my place. What say you? I'm loving it so far. Depth introduction. Well. Show me your map. I've marked the location for you of a hidden gateway. Nice. It will lead you to Garank, the beast clergyman. Red mark was added to the map. Oh, way over there. Okay. Ending gate. Okay, so he's there. Uh, who's this dude? That is one weird cane you got going on, buddy. Oh, this is a rare occasion. I can't remember the last time a new tarnished made their way to the round table. Very well. As your senior, I bid you welcome. It is safe here. You may let down your guard. Allow me a word of advice. As your senior, you are a mere visitor to the round table. Nothing more. A house guest. Yet to earn their keep. Remember your place, newcomer. Well, one minute he sounds welcoming, the next minute he sounds like he's a jerk. <sighs> fire. Didn't expect fire. Be sure to tell me if she's a servant. She's been my companion. I've lost count of the number of times. Honestly. She yeah, right. Your servant. Go hug, get hugged by Ladyface. I don't know, uh... I don't know what it does for me, but... Hopefully nothing negative. I am pleased to see you. Give me again. some sweet, sweet hugs, baby. Would you like me to hold you once more? Oh yeah, hook, hook, is still a, hook a guy up. Your breast, dear. Would oh, is you it? like to be held? Regardless? No. Not really. Then good day to you, my dear. How do I know when it burns out? I don't understand. Free hugs! <laughs> And it gives us some sort of a buff of some kind, but it's really non-specific well, about what it is. I took you for dinner matter, it's all the same. Lay out your arms then. Alright, uh, strength armaments. Yeah, I can upgrade this thing even more, so maybe we'll do that. Broadsword plus two, broadsword plus three. Sure, why not, right? No, oh, maybe we'll upgrade this thing too. I don't know what the benefit is of upgrading this, but let's find out. <laughs> Upgraded my finger seal. Wonder if I would have been better off upgrading the Lord Sworn Straight Sword. Broadsword Sword plus four is 137. I can't remember whether D is better for, like, is it the, uh... The lower the letter in the alphabet, the better the scaling for the given attribute? Need a cape? Oh man, this armor I found comes with it automatically. Look at it. Isn't it great? This is, uh, I got this from killing one of the knights. Um... It's this thing here. Godric knight armor. Comes automatically with a cape on it. It's pretty sweet. I had this one first, and then I swapped over to that. But yeah, it looks great. Cool. Alright, well it's after uh, after mid by night time. It's already like 20 after 12. Uh, I'm going to be streaming this again tomorrow. Swap back over to my webcam view here. Find the clicky button for it. There we go. There's a little messed up for my headset. Uh, I'm going to be live again tomorrow. Actually, I'm streaming during the day. I took the day off work. Uh, so I'll probably be live uh, around either 9 a.m. or 10 a.m. tomorrow morning, uh, playing through the day uh, some more of Elden Ring because I'm having a ton of uh, ton of fun with it. Super, super excited to get deeper into it and see what else we can find. But uh, thanks so much, everyone, for coming out tonight. I really do appreciate it. Uh, thank you also for all the uh, exceedingly generous super chats. Uh, you're all fabulous. Uh, hopefully some of you can come and hang out tomorrow while we're playing. I'm, as always, Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.